much better i'm so sorry for you guys and welcome to another makimo extreme so yesterday i couldn't have done anything because there was a lot of problems uh related to sound and my neighbors just banging away drilling away uh, yeah tons of problems i really didn't want to uh to be to be having with them so yeah today we are going to be continuing the Emerald Nuzlocke we started a little while back. I think it was a week ago. And yeah, we're going to have some fun. So last time we collected two different badges. We had like six Pokemon in total. So we have Diamond Blade the Gengar. Uh, <laughs> I don't know the, the names in... <laughs> okay, so Prime Ape is the Life Potion. Joe is a Dugong. Duraso is a Lunatone. Mokao is a Golduck, and Crystal Lee is a Numel. So yeah, we have we have a pretty good team overall. Um, although we might be lacking like a something like a fire type or something to that regard. A fire or electric type would be perfect. I'd kind of be tempted to replace Mokao at one point or another, but for now. This seems, this seems still pretty decent. So we are currently um, at Dufour Town. I think we have defeated the gym leader here already. Yeah, this is not, this is not completely dark anymore. So this place has been completely emptied out. If my memory serves me correctly, we have done pretty much everything we could do here. Uh, we do have access to Flash. We have Cut. Uh, key items. Devon Goods. Wait, haven't we brought the Devon Goods back to... Oh, that's an item we could, we could definitely get. I am not sure if we got to... To the, uh, to the uh, key item over there. Maybe. Let's see. Oi, for you, I'll go to out to see at the time. Uh, we need to go to Petalburg again? We are not going to Slateport just yet. Um, the reason for that is that we need to bring back the Devon Goods. I completely forgot about those. So yeah, let's do this. But yeah, uh, these days I've been I've been pretty pretty moving. Uh, how would I say it? Like there there's there there's been like a lot of things that, that have come into my life and uh, emote commissions have been one of them. I've been I've been working on making um, emote commissions and and trying to uh, to shift away anything that is money away from the stream. I do not want to... Oh, spikes. That's not bad. That means I can get a free... I missed? Wait, 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 wait. I didn't see the actual... Oh, double edge. Okay, it doesn't affect me because I'm, I'm a ghost type, of course. Yeah, I've been trying to shift away, like, the, the responsibility of money uh, f away from the stream. I want... I want this to be a fun... A fun jolt of things. I want to have fun with this. I want to have fun streaming. And I want to shift away everything that is money, business related, away from it. And... Yeah, just... Just have fun for the sake of having fun and not for... Uh, for the sake of having money, you know? Alright, uh, wasn't there some items inside the guard each? I don't remember. There there was... I think there was something... 
That was an item that you could get in here. No, apparently not. It's been a long, long, long while since I played Emerald. Well, not counting the Nuzlocke Randomizer, of course. Hey, XP share. So, from forgiving the Devon good... Wait, that, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, for the... Wait, no, the... Was it the Devon Goods? What did I want to give the Devon Goods to? That's all right. But since we have the good old XP share, might as well give it to somebody here. Um, what would be a good call to give it to? Crystal Lily is kind of low level, so if I give it to her. Would be a good call, I'd say. Alright. But yeah, I had fun making the, uh... The overall limit commissions for... For Mikael, and... It taught me a lot about how to draw doggos at all. I didn't know how to, to draw dogs that well before. Like my my usual doggo is like <laughs> is like three or four strokes and then a white background and then two dots. And then a couple of lines for the face and that's it. <laughs> no shading, no <laughs> no fur, no anything. So it was was kind of a kind of a good experience to draw something better than just that. <laughs> I'm selling your boats, old man. Okay, can you... There we go. I have... I have business with the old man, not the Pokemon. But yeah. So yeah, that was... That was quite the... Uh, the interesting thing to do. By the way, is my mic a little bit loud? I can reduce it a tiny little bit. It seems like it's a little bit too loud at times, so I'm go just going to use just that. There we go. That seems a little bit better. Alright, sleep port. The, re the usual reason why I have it like so, so, so loud is that on Discord, I don't know why, Discord likes to just reduce the, the sound of my own voice. Like it's super, 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 super low. And I don't know why. I don't know why at all. Oh, I forgot that these... Oh, no. Oh, no. This is a double battle. Tuba Leo and... Someone P. Oh, no. Oh, no. Actually, it's not too bad. They're level 13, and this is level 10 and level 25. It does suck that it reduced my attack, though. Our trait should be able to deal quite a lot of damage there. And Rock Slide is going to hurt both of these. Nice. And this is super effective on Lugia. Although Lugia has super resistant. <gasps> Diamond Blade! No! Oh no. I have to switch Diamond Blade out. Ah, no. No. Hopefully I can just kill the both of these at once. Person still stayed alive. Maybe maybe the outrage will be will be good for for this. There's a chance that Diamond Blade might survive. Crystal is gaining levels. Six levels out of that. Wow. Seven? Wow. All the way to level seven, huh? Okay, Persian is now dead. That was... That was some nice experience for Crystal Lily here. Oh, but I don't get to... Oh, no. I don't even get to... To recover anything. Got oh, Tuba Lee Sorrows. Okay, skip Bloom. I can't let Diamond Blade stay. 
I can't let Diamond Blade stay at all. If I do let Diamond Blade stay, uh, he's gonna die. Uh, putting John the line is not the play either. Let's put Life Potion in again. Life Potion is strong. Silverwind. What was... What is Silverwind? This is the first time I'm, I'm seeing... This attack. Um, what could I do? I don't think Rock Slide will be helpful against Kiplum, right? Oh, no, it is. Never mind. So it is effective against grass types. Good to know. Crystal Lily is already at level 9. Good lord. XP share strong. <laughs> I have Lisa Rose on my on my fucking Uh I would love I would absolutely love to get into a Poké Center right around now. Where is it? Is it? Nah, it's right there. There we go. Resting as a Pokemon. Uh, so let's see. Diamond Blade is still not strong enough. So what we want to do is have them be as strong as possible before we do anything. For this, we will definitely buy a couple of super potions. And a couple of super balls as well. Do I have an escape rope? Yes. Do I have anything else to help? Kinda. Alright. Hey, Cosmic, thank you so much for the host. How are you doing? Alrighty, so, um... There are still many, many fights we need to do here. I'm doing very well, glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear it. Yeah, I was talking about how the, um... The week has been, like, a little bit... If you have a question, a would you rather? Let's let's hear it. Let's hear it. Oh, rock throw worked. Not uh, not too strong though. You would like to know what I what I think? Yeah, go ahead. Ask me. Would I rather have unlimited bacon, but no more games or? I I yeah I, I think I think you might have <laughs> you might have <laughs> had a problem in your would you rather <laughs> would you rather have unlimited bacon but no more games or games unlimited games and no games <laughs> I think that might be a problem there <laughs> I take the first one if that's the case <laughs> it's all intended what do you mean. So, games unlimited and no games. So, you have games where you can play games. So, instead, you, you take the bacon. Like, I don't understand what you, what you mean by the second one. It's a, it's a, it's okay. I'm just I'm just struggling to understand. So yeah, I was I was talking about how I I'm so ooh. Is this going to be effective? No. But yeah, I, I was talking about how making different Oh, that's going to be effective. Um, Cal was trying to shift things away from... From the stream, like everything, everything that is money related to off the stream 
So, for example, I managed to to finally start off my commissions and whatnot. And so, thus, I had like a lot of fun working on some some random art and whatnot, but also be able to make some money out of it and not be pressured off of the stream because of it. I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah. So trying to shift away everything that is like business-like off of the stream so I could just focus on having fun and having like as many as many things as I would want to without having to that the stress that comes behind it. How are you can you can you please not? Thankfully I can't I can't be poisoned and paralyzed at the same time, but good lord. That does a lot of damage. Wait, Vice Grip? Let's see. Grips the foe with large and powerful pincers. Okay, sure. Mm, I'll get that out of the way. Speaking of the commissions, all of these are great. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I made I made five in total for for Mu, and two of them are in bit emotes, if I remember correctly. But yeah, I had a ton of fun making those, and at the same time, was able to to make to make my food for uh, for the two, next two weeks. So yeah, this is this is something I I'm really really happy about. I'm still going to try and and see if I can make like some like I'm going to try and reach some of the people who might or might not want some emotes and try to make work off of that but yeah for now I just I just want to be to, to make as many as many options for myself on the side while while still having as much fun as I can a tiny mushroom And also, I'm trying. I'm trying to um, to have as much fun as possible. Um, creating some other things I couldn't before. Like for example, today I was struggling. Well, actually, before I was struggling. Oh, uh, actually, is this going to hurt? Not too much normally. Yeah, I was struggling making videos before. Like, a lot of struggle. But now that I've managed to to find a way to... Uh, to relieve some of the stress I had, like, making those has been, has been a lot more possible. So right now I was, I, I'm working, like, on, a, on this small... on a small 10-minute video about, about uh, Mario and the Cursed Castles that I did in... back in 2020. Because I want, I wanted to to showcase like the the, the different. Ooh, waylord. Oh, this is no. Ouch! Ow! Oh, baby blade! No! No! Well, red diamond blade. I'll take life potion to just to 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 to. to. I did not expect the waylord to have the shadow ball. That shadow ball hurts. Alright, needle arm. Bam. Ah, oh, that sucks. Ah, oh, diamond blade. No. Moo! It was it was killed by Moo. Ah, oh, that sucks. That's alright though. Let's see. Well, no, that's not alright. We lost, we lost the mon and we lost diamond blades. That absolutely sucks. Eh. Someone's TC. We have uh, deposit Pokemon. <laughs> Goodbye, diamond blade, and my macho brace. 
<laughs> oh, that hurts. That was two. That was two. Two good things that just went poof in an instant. That's ah. Uh... All right. I'll put Joe back onto the main spot here. But yeah, so I, I, I started to make like a, um, a video about Mario and the Curse Castles and what I realized is that the main problem I have with the videos I make is that they are either too long or require way too much of me to be able to have fun with those. And that's interesting. <laughs> I got... <laughs> He got poisoned before I could even poison tail him. Ooh, that is, that is, that was effective. So yeah, I started to, to make like some smaller videos. Instead of going for a full length video about one hack, I'm going to make like small 10 minute videos about those. And I'm going to edit like some, some parts inside those to make them more interesting to see in the long run rather than making a long video that might not be completely completely watchable. Uh, I don't want to switch. Joe is fine as where he is. Oh. You are so dead. Give me one turn. You are going to die. <laughs> Solar beam! But yeah, so I want to do something like that for um, for Mario 64 overall, making some small 10-minute videos that serve serve more as highlights for what I've been doing with it. Oh, substance! Thank you. And then this way I'll be able to to make to make more videos and to have them be of a higher quality than usual than usual like right now i've i've picked like the first 10 minutes of of curse castles and there there was a lot of things i realized while doing this uh, the first one being good lord my my voice back in 2020 was not the quality it was right now and even even today it's not it's not perfect either but it's still way better than it was back in 2020 and also hey there pushing how are you doing how are you doing my friend oh you are so dead you are so dead yeah ice punch is not going to be a 202 too good against Dugong here. Solar Beam! Wait, what? What? Wait, 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 wait. What? Is it why not a, a, a water type? Weird. You okay? Didn't go in for that surgery today, going tomorrow instead? Oh, I sure hope, I sure hope you'll be better though. Like I sure hope that th that's going to go well and you'll be you'll be all good. We're worried about you these days, potion. Oh, there there is no need to thank me. I'm just I'm just worried about you, man. I'm right here, lady. A beauty SMO man. That's not what I expected out of that. Oh, whoa. Heal bell? Oh, no. That's gonna suck. You do be slapping though. The 
bell chimes. How long do I have to knock off? Okay. Oh, the match race. No. Can I use poison tail against fire flight types? Yes, apparently. Yeah, there we go. That was that was scary. Not gonna lie, but Crystal Lee is level 14 now. It is perfect. These specials are great. It'll be okay. Yeah, hopefully so. Hopefully so. How am I today? I'm doing pretty well. Uh, having a lot of fun going through going through Pokemon Emerald uh, as a Nuzlocke. This is my very, very first Nuzlocke, so... Well, my very, very first Nuzlocke attempt at Emerald. Uh, I don't think I've ever tried Nuzlocke on any other game before. I don't think so. I've tried Renders before, but never a Nuzlocke. So this is this is kind of a fun experience to me. All right, you fall so an attack. Did you fall so you doom? Oh, that was a critical a critical hit. That's good. But yeah, having fun having fun making some. Oh, uh, is this going to work? Poison tail? I think so, right? It should work normally. But yeah, having a lot of fun making some new stuff. By the way, I changed one of the emotes uh, without telling anyone. Uh, because one of the emotes I had was not exactly what I wished for it to be. And so, I, and so thus I changed it to be a little bit better suited to what I wanted it to be. So the emote I changed was the Makimo Gib emote. This one. Ooh. Is this going to hurt? No, not so much. This is resistant. This is very resilient, but... We're also good, so it's okay. I'm going to... Wait. Oh, no. What? What? Can you please not? Okay, one more? Ah. Oh no. Okay, it's missed. Okay, we're good. Woo! That was close. That was rough. That was a rough fight. Oh, hydro pump. Yes. Yes. I wanted a water, a water move here. Yeah. And it has a hundred accuracy as well. That is great. Hey, that I'm in blade. I am so sorry. You died. I am so, so sorry. So that was the Waylord. That was the Waylord that came in um, while I was trying to level up the Gengar that was named after you. And all of a sudden came with Shadow Ball and one shot you. So I was like, no! And I had to release you while you still had my Macho Brace on. I was super sad about it. Because I both lost, I both lost the great Pokemon and at the same time lost my Macho Brace. Okay. Oh, Powder Jaw. I'll take it. Okay, uh, are the shops randomized? I am not sure. I don't think so. Yeah, these are not randomized. Ah, 
How does a ghost Pokemon die? With Shadow Balls, apparently. Shadow Balls is all you need. Yeah, that's that's massacred the poor the poor Gengar here. There was nothing I could do. Is there one last? Oh, Sawbop. I'll buy some. I'll buy a little bit of Sawbop. Sawbop is a great source of healing. Yeah, that was that was super sad. I'm so 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 sorry about this. But yeah, how have you been on your uh, on your side, Darren Blade? How how was the things? I'm part I'm part I'm part of the team Aqua now. Can you please get out of the museum? No. Fine. This is the Pokemon. Battle tent, right? Yeah, I have no place being here right now. Battle tents might not be the thing I want to do. The fairy service is not good. It's been a long while since I played this game. I don't remember exactly where to go. I think I want to head north. And that there's going to be all scrap. I think I remember this place. And hey, there's a place where I can get some Pokemon. Oh, it's a septile. Okay. Please don't kill him. Please don't kill him, Joe. I beg of you. Just two snaps. Oh, you'll yeah, yeah, just miss. Hey, one. Oh, actually, it's not too much damage. It has a lot of HP. Uh, I'm, not, I'm only getting two slaps, though. Doing well, being super busy and making some changes to your slaps so there's been testing. Yeah, I feel that. I've had, like, the same thing uh, happen to me as well. Oh, no. That means I'm going to have to use a Great Ball right about now. I'm making it drop to 50% and now I'm using a Great Ball. Because if I don't cure that poison... This mon is going to die. Alright, I'm going to use a Safari Ball. Just for the heck of it. Yeah, Safari Ball strong! <laughs> <laughs> Safari Ball strong! <laughs> Septile! Let's go! Alright, uh, let's name this one Cosmic. A boink. Alright, uh, how many each how much HP do you have? Fifteen. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, well, there we go. Yeah, I didn't I didn't expect to catch it with the Safari Ball. I thought it was just going to do boink once and then just just explode. But no, uh, apparently we captured it. So we can't go any further on this. Where do I go then? I don't remember having to do much here. Oh, uh, maybe I need to go inside the docks here. Talk to the, uh... Which... which... Wasn't I supposed to talk to somebody over here? Over yonder? Maybe you? 
No? Hmm. Maybe you. Okay, so I need to find the Captain Stern and deliver the package to him. Uh, Captain Stern, Captain Stern. Oh, there we go. Now we can get inside. And now we can fight the... Uh... Oh, 10 foot 6. Nice. Man, you have a lot of hearts. <laughs> A lot of love and lots of hearts. Mm. Isn't there like one or two I can fight? That do be a lot of hearts, right? Are you Captain Stern? Yes, there we go. We'll take those parts! No, do not take my parts, please. I need those parts. These parts are mine. Mine, 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 mine. You collect heart emotes as one. La I, I, didn't, I didn't see that I was fighting a Lashes there. What? Uh, poison? Calm mind. Oh, special attack. Oh, no. That kind of sucks. Okay, still deal damage with Poison Tail, though. Oh, it has Bullet Seed, though. Hearts, super hard to find them on mobile, though, yeah. At this point, if I, if I ever need an emote, I'll just make it myself now. <laughs> The wonders of being able to to make emotes. It's also great to be able to make to make some my life out of them now as well. And hey, did you? Hey, boo! Just casually killing a lot, yes. Don't mind me. The button mash definitely. Ba -ba 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 because I didn't have I didn't have much of of choices here to. Uh... So I'm going to. Oh, oh no, that hurts. What is this? Maybe it's poison type. This is going to kill me if I stay... If I keep Joe. I'm, I'm, I'm going to protect you, Joe. I'm going to protect you. Yeah, level 14 did that much. What the? Seriously, man. Die already. Okay, that's the Mag B. I'm going to switch it to Joe so I can just Hydro Pulse it. But yeah, dang. What kind of stuff is it? I think, right? I think it's more like the, uh, the, the attack itself that has like insane stats. <gasps> Joe, no! No! No, 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 no! Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> that actually scares me. That was actually scary for a moment. Weep. Weep. <laughs> okay, thankfully, Electric Tackle, uh, well, Volt Tackle was not... was not too, too bad. <laughs> Didn't even have to fight the uh to do there. So whoops, no time to lose. Thanks again, got to go. Wait, but I already have the Devon goods. What? Do I have them twice now? 
No, I gave them the living goods. Okay. All right. So what to do? Okay. So I drove the team acquire away. Scott gives us the fucking thing. It's been so long. It's been so 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 long. We are definitely recovering the Pokémon Turbo. <laughs> I do not want to lose another Pokémon here. One was more than enough. I might want uh, to check the stats of Cosmic, though. What, what kind of stats do you have? 27, 27, 27, 22, 33. Uh, let's compare this to... Oh, yeah. Actually... This might be way better to level up Cosmic rather than Crystal Lily. I'm sorry, Crystal Lily, but you have, like, really bad stats right now. Yeah, I might I might take the, uh, the XP share from Crystal Lily for now. And keep her as a backup just in case afterwards. Uh, let's give Cosmic a... Next year. Yeah, it's a fully evolved Pokemon for sure. Yeah, thus, thus why I want to give the XP share to them first. All right, Prof Birch is giving me. Things. There we go. Oh, wow. that's a double battle. Do we have the Pokemon to defeat those? All right, it might be good to level up both Joe and Life Potion at the same time. BRB, no problem. Absolutely no problem. That was a couple of things. I've... Oh, Morpha! Morpha is in here! <laughs> Uh, so yeah, there has been like a couple of, of things I wanted to do um, for um, in regards of m music. Like when you co when it concerns like game video game music and uh, how to. Oh no! No! It dug a hole! It dug a hole! Wait, life potions? Oh, it's missed just for... For Quagsire, okay. Is it going to dig before Dugong's uses their... Nope. Solabe has used before. Ouch. That's going to be a little bit of a pain. But yeah, so I wanted to try something in regards uh, to video game music in general. There is no way to see for video game music in general. You can't find like which ones are okay to, to, to have on, which ones are not okay to have on. Like it's a real pain to try and find the, uh, the the games you can actually play on Twitch. So what I want to do is to try and find a way to to contact like a lot of publishers and video game makers. And <sighs> okay, that's not too bad. Yeah, try and contact a lot of video game makers, a lot of publishers and whatnot, and ask them whether it is okay or not to use their videos on Twitch in um, in, t in terms of having like the affiliate contract and whatnot or if you can use those on YouTube uh, we are good we are good but Joe is going to have to take a, uh, his bow very soon or I could just heal him using Life Potion Stun. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to Hydro Pump this dude here and use a Super Potion. 
On just down. Oh, on life potion stand. There we go. And good thing I did. Oh, well, actually, that's not too bad. I thought that was going to be way more than this. There we go. Level 22. Oh dear, this one do. We're asking a lot of of creators, a lot of uh, game programmer, well, programmers, lots of of companies that are making games and whatnot to to ask if it's okay to use their their um, music in general into any kind of stream or any kind of. Of video content like YouTube. I am going to be heading to the Pokemon Center while I do my my own thing. So yeah, trying to ask those if if it's okay to use them in stream to try and see if you can if we can get like some written form of that content. That we could apply for anybody here and make it like make a huge list that people could watch at any moment and be like yeah i can do this game because this game has no problems with this music or i can do this game but i'm going to have to mute to mute it all together to be able to play it uh like stuff like that And then if people if people want to to help out with that kind of thing, they definitely would be able to. That's interesting. Wait, that didn't. Or maybe because Dugong is also a nice type. Man, having hydro pump. Oh no, Corbs! Corbs gear! We defeated last corpse gear. Uh, I think I need to take the top path, right? I am getting the item though. The item is Moin. But yeah, going around tossing a lot of mails and and requests on Twitter. And getting like all of the replies and all of the, uh, the things required to... to help people out with this, because DMC on Twitch is one of the biggest problems you could have right now. Well, it's one of, it's one of the many, many, many problems that are playing in the platform, and being able to help out with that kind of... Thing would help a lot. Bringing out like many. Oh, we drew it. That's interesting. Ah, this is going to, to not hurt. No, never mind. That's what that was a crit. Nice. Wait, is this going to be effective against? Oh, yes, apparently. I do be slapping though. But yeah, doing my own research, making a big list for for which games you can actually stream, which game music you can use without even playing the game would be great. Because there, there are some games that have, that have like an absolutely beautiful music, but that is absolutely not streamable. Like, for example, Nights in the Nightmare. I've, I don't know if, if anybody here has even, even heard of the game at all. But the game has, like, some beautiful music. And it's such a shame that we can't know if it's playable or not unless we ask for the people who have made them. So, yeah. 
This is something I want I want to do. So first I'm going to be to be focusing. Wow, found a scroll. I want to be focusing on finding. Uh whoops. Before I go any further. Still a pop, please. Ah actually just a potion should be enough. Where are you? But yeah, there's there's some games are that are absolutely beautiful that have like absolutely beautiful soundtracks and that you cannot you cannot know if you can use them or not on on Twitch. And the the biggest shame about this is that this could also bring people to those games and help people just discover them in general. Or oh, harden. Uh, can I use hydro pump? Not sure. Oh yeah, it's it's very effective. Nice. Uh, I might switch to life potion because I don't have too much EP for hydro pump anymore. So life potion might be a bad idea. Let's see. Slaking. I think rock slide should be good enough. Uh, it's deal, it deals damage, but mm, is not too, too good either. Reduced my speed, but ah. Child of Light has a great soundtrack, but it's copyrighted and found out via a take a takedown request. Yeah, here's here's oh no, life potion. No potion. That slaking survived with one HP, just barely enough to kill Potion with, just because of Scary Face. Are you kidding me? Man, I lost two Pokemons here. Come on. I'm not sure if I want to keep this move. <laughs> you know what? You know what? I'll keep it just in case. I'll keep it just in case for Leroy Jenkins. <laughs> just in case there's, there's like there's like no chance whatsoever I'm going to, to be able to keep a Pokemon alive. But yeah, Potion is definitely going to get released. Yeah, Disparate moves. Disparate Mughal moves is what I'm going to call it. Alright. I'm sorry, Potion. <laughs> I'm sorry, Potion. You, you stayed with me all the way through the game so far. So I have to release you. Goodbye, Pushin. Alright, so I guess it's going to be Cosmic... Cosmic's Advent. Cosmic needs to level up now. I'm going to see if there are capabilities though. Um, so first I'm going to switch it with Doso and then switch it with Joe. I don't think you gain double XP if you have like XP share on you, right? Oh, Wisma. I can't capture it, I've already caught my... my money here. So I think Mike Punch 
would be a good move to, to just spam out here. Yeah, that's quite a few... Quite a few amounts of damage there. Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't level up too much though. I'm going to try and see if I can just deal with the trainers here before I go into the the hut. Aroma Lady Wellington. <laughs> All right, no matter what I do, do not press self-destruct. <laughs> do not slip out. Okay. Oh no. Is this confused? Oh no, this is sleeping. Cosmic, do be doing the sleep. I, do want, I don't want to be doing the sleep. So, a full restore? A bit too early for that. Don't I have like an anti sleep thing? Awakening. There we go. <gasps> that hurts. Hack punch, please. Pa! Man, the mons here are so strong. Oh, fine whip. That'd be great. And doesn't Crystal lead Pokemon evolve so it can get to another random Pokemon? Maybe. I'm not sure if this is going to be a random, a completely random Pokemon. I think so, but I'm not sure. A Grass type would be better than Rock type right now. I'm lacking Grass type moves. We'll see how it goes, though. Right now, I do need. At least two Pokemons that have like a good. Oh no! I I goofed. Cosmic is dead. <gasps> no, he's alive. He's alive. Oh yeah, Hunter couldn't evolve into Gengar. Right, right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Can you, can you please not? Thank you. Uh, so I think Vine Whip could be useful against them. Yeah. Oh wait, isn't that to move that deals a ton of damage? No, okay, we're good. Oh, thank you, Nya. And also, hey there. I try. I tried to change the, the bongo cats into 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 floof, and I got to to that this way. You can, you're making me nervous. I know. I'm sorry. I'm bad at Pokemon. I'm bad at Pokemon. This this is why this is the third uh, the third seed. Like the second, the the this, the first two seeds went horribly wrong, <laughs> and with my luck, it's not going to get any better. <laughs> All right, uh, this is a double battle. Kind of scared for Cosmic here. Let's take away for the XP share from Cosmic and give him a better item. I think there's something that, yeah, powers up the, the power of grass moves. And we'll give Great Curse Lily the XP share. We battle together has one team. Alright, a far fetched D and Tediosa. Mm -hmm. I think a Mac Punch would work against the Diosa. Uh, Hydro Pump doesn't affect both of these. I might want to attack Farfetch'd with. Yeah, that's a nice move. Signal Beam? Ouch! That hurts! 
There you go. That was one profit down. And flail missed. Perfect. Let's do another mag punch and double stab just in case the mag punch is not enough. Nice. There you go. That hurts Farfetch'd even more, yeah. I mean, it's good enough, I guess. <laughs> oh, um... I don't think I'll be able to defeat this thing well, but we'll see. Yeah. Oh, that, and that was a critical... <laughs> Doesn't make sense to put Joe here, but Icy Wind is not going to be effective against Dugong anyway. Ooh. That is scary, though. A flail. Okay. Yeah, Joe is named after Joe Dark. Yeah. Because Joe, Joe is, Joe is Joe. Because, okay, so we had a Joe Dark. But the problem is that Joe Dark had a, a horrible fate. Then we had Joe Dark Dark. And that Joe Dark Dark also had a horrible fate. And so thus we named Joe as Joe. And now Joe is alive for now. <laughs> So hopefully this Geo doesn't encounter the same fate as the other ones. <laughs> I really don't want to. I'm going to be say to be uh going back to the Pokemon Center. I really do not want to go to the right side. The right side has the the rival, and the rival is going to destroy us. Is that like a permadeath on the Pokemon? So, I'm playing with Nuzlocke rules. Only one Pokemon, I can capture only one Pokemon per road. So, this, this route here, uh, I've already captured my one Pokemon, so I cannot capture any Pokemons on here anymore. And if a Pokemon dies, well, it's, it's over for them definitively. So yeah, fun times. Fisherman Alina Center Vigorov. Wow, that's a weak Pokemon here. I'm not going to be getting much XP out of that, but I'm going to be smashing. Does Nuzlocke require buying a lot of potions? Uh, so far, I have had the need for a couple of potions here and there. Oh, that's not... Uh, ha, ha, ha. That is a problem. Should be able to deal with it still, but... Okay, that's not going to deal too much damage. We're good. Yeah! We should be able to level up to level 18. Nice. A Charmeleon. Depends on the moves they have, but I can't. Oh, pump. Oh, it lost its focus and good move. Nice. But yeah, Nuzlocke, Nuzlocke does require you to to know at least what you're doing and not to to take risks. And since I'm more like the, the the risky type to play this game, it's absolutely horrible for me to play it. <laughs> Because I try, I try my best to uh, to to play within the limits of the game, but at the same time, at the same time, the game can ha can have like moves that are not exactly what you expect it to be. Okay, 
Wait, that doesn't... What? I mean, that doesn't affect me. Oh, but it paralyzed me. That's a problem. It's missed? Wow. I kind of like that Mac, Mac Punch is still faster. Oh, it's not dealing any damage at all. But I can't send Joe. That's the problem. I can't send Joe either. Oh, that deals more damage. That's the problem. Okay, Brick Break is much better against them. I have uh, lots of people... Oh. Oh, ho. Confused due to panic. Perfect. So that means I can actually use a full restore there? That'd be kind of a shame. Let's just use this ace to pop here. A lot of people normally don't use any any items inside the battles, but I can't. I I am I'm very much a, a newbie at at playing at playing Pokemon Nuzlocke. Like this is my very first one. Oh, Cosmic Spiralize. Dang it! Dang it! And snapped out of confusion. Vital... Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, that didn't deal much damage. Stop missing it! Bah! Yeah, I need... I need to use another potion. Because if I send if I send Joe, Joe is going to be to be destroyed by the uh, by the Thunderbolt, and Cosmic is like super resistant to that. So at least it's better if I do it this way. All right, this is dead. Woo! Let's go. Crystal Lee is now eighteen. Okay, does this Pokemon evolve at 18? No. Okay, so it's Pokemon Center time again. Dang it! But yeah, I'm quite unlucky when it comes to... Um, to randomizers and whatnot, so... This is why I have to err more on the safer side. Especially since I don't know that the, the moves that Pokemons are going to have. It does require going to the Poké Center a lot. There is a certain Nuzlocke rule um, that you can... Like, it's it's optional. You don't have to do it every time. But there is an optional Nuzlocke rule that's, that asks you to use the Poké Center just a single time and not using any, uh, any, ob any items whatsoever. And I'm like, nope, nope, I'm not doing those kinds of rules. Yep, I'm not doing those kinds of rules. I kind of like my life, you know. Ooh, Iron Tail might be a problem. Let's try Brick Break. Yeah, pe people can beat the game with that rule. Why is Torment? Oh, just... Okay, I can use Back Punch. That's not a problem. This is going to kill. Combeskin is dead. Cosmic is, is leveling up nicely here. But yeah, Pokemon, people can definitely beat Pokemon using that troll and have done so before. I think there was like a huge spreadsheet uh, with all of the different optional rules you can have uh, inside any Pokemon game. Those were the harshest ones I could f I, I could remember, but there there's there's a lot more that would add like some interesting variation and challenges to to the thing. So for example, normally you can only capture one Pokemon in an area, but if you encounter like a same type of Pokemon, uh, like for example, let's say I find another Dugong into into the wild. Uh, I can re-roll, basically, the, the encounter for for this spot. I found a stick. What? What is this stick for? Oh, okay, that's for... That's for Harpaged. 
<laughs> I don't have any one, but that's fine. It's a nice challenge if it gets too easy for people. Yeah, Nuzlocke, Nuzlocke is pretty interesting altogether because it forces you to to think about how you're going to be doing doing the thing instead of just throwing your Pokemon, let them die, and then throw some other Pokemons and whatnot. Egg bomb. Ooh. Ooh, that hurts. If not, a break break is, is enough. It deals slightly, slightly a little bit more than... This is scary. Youngster Yosh sent an electrode. Uh, I am actually... <laughs> Sorry about this. I'm actually super scared about that one. Let me let me take a turn. Let me take a turn to use this solar pop here. Outrage. That's not going to be chilling too much. We're going to Fontaine slugged in Outrage for a while. So let's do a brick break again. Nice. And it's confused. So I am going to doing to be doing a Mac Punch just in case it's going to oh well never mind crit. I was going to say just in case it's going to um, to try and hurt itself in its confusion. Uh, flatter. What is flatter? Confuses the foe but raises its special attack. Uh, I don't need that. The problem of Crystal Lee being a, a staple of the team, however, is that she is also a... She also uses my HMs, so... Oh, Altaria. I love uh, Altaria. I really love the design of Altaria. Doesn't deal that much damage, but... Oh. Does it deal... Is that is it good? Is that bad? Oh no, that's just the awesome normal damage. Okay. How about Mag Punch? I think this is a flight, so it's not going to be dealing too much either. Ah. What? Really now? Really now? Well, I'm busting out Joe. See, this is the kind. This is the kind of of luck I'm dealing with. I think a double slap should be enough. If you if you, if you paralyze him, I am going to flip everything I have. <laughs> Try attacking this game is strong. I don't care too much about burn. Burn is not too bad. Paralyze or freeze though is another problem altogether. Ah, just one more hit would have been good enough. <gasps> okay, that didn't deal too much damage. I thought that was good. That was going to, to to murder Joe, but no, we're good. Yeah, the main problem with oh, poison is that it deals damage out of the... Oh, wait, but Cosmic is still frozen. Whoops. Um... Yeah, let's send Joe in. Yeah, that shouldn't deal any damage at all. The burn is going to deal time. Oh, and confusion as well. I'm going to use a full wrestle. I am not taking the risk here. I'm going to use a full wrestle. Imagine using a full wrestle against the wild Pokemon. Couldn't be me, right? Yeah, I had to make sure that this hit. So I'm really, really, really ultra scared of the upcoming encounter. 
the rival there is ultra scary. Like, ultra super mega scary. So this is why I'm trying to get to, to do my best to get as many levels as possible for all of my Pokemon. Because if I if I lose one Pokemon, I still have to go on. I still have the other ones to to use. Ah. When do you evolve? Crystal Lee, evolve please! I need to know what Pokemon you have. So I can decide if I want to to to, to move my HMs to something else. We don't know about the um the password here, so we can go straight to this platform here. Master Trickster is fabulous. And that's a rare candy. Wait, did I leave the place thinking there was more than this and then I just didn't get the rare candy at the, mo the one moment I needed? I... I have no words. I have no words. Why do I keep encountering fly types? I can't fight this with Cosmic. Alright. It is time for this encounter. This encounter wiped me. When I was a child. Like, it's actually pretty, pretty decently strong. Oh, that actually de that actually dealt a lot of damage. Nice. Dragon Dance. I don't think I ever wanted to... To attack here. Yeah, you're dead. Okay, I thought, I thought that this was going to go way worse than this, but we actually... We, we managed to deal with one of the... The mons there. Duck Trio. That is good. We do have Vine Whip. And we can deal with this with Mag Punch for the last hit. Nice! Cosmic is pulling a lot of weight there. A Swallow. What is this? What is this Pokemon? What? I don't even... Rec I, I, I don't recognize this Pokemon. What? What type is this? Let's try, let's try Vine Whip. Oh, of course the attack missed. Uh, low kick, not too bad. Okay, it's, it's... Might be a poison type. Might be a poison type, so I might want to switch to Joe? Question mark? <gasps> Never mind! Joe is weak to, to, to those attacks. Oh. Okay, I'll do one Hydro Pump, just in case. Okay, that dealt quite... Okay, I'm going to take a risk. If it doesn't crit... If the, if the, if the Pokemon doesn't crit... We will be able to prevail. If it does, we're in deep trouble. <gasps> <laughs> that was close. <laughs> that was close. Okay, so the scary, scary encounter is off. The list. 
Ooh. How I wish I have a bicycle right now. But I don't. I will... Mm, I'll use a super potion on Joe. And on Cosmic. Actually, two super potions on Joe. Let's go. And then we'll continue onwards. So as not to, to make a, a useless trip to... <gasps> oh, that's the God of War. Made the train. A uh, God of War is a psychic type, I think. Stop giga draining me. That kind of sucks, but hey, let's share the XP anyway. But I see your Pokemon. Just one look, please. But yeah, I kind of want to take a small break from, um, from Origami King, uh, on Monday. And I want to try and do some more Mario 64, but because I'm, I'm really missing it. I can't, I can't stay too much interested in, in Origami King. I really try though. Like it's funny and whatnot, there's, there's like some funny things about it, but... Oh, and that's really hard to stay focused in it. SM64 is best. SM64 is great. And there's like a ton of RAM hacks that still have to play all together. So what I might do is like one Mario 64 RAM hack, then go back to Origami King, and then maybe try a Mario World RAM hack one day. Uh, after Origami King. Because, yeah. I was very much interested in playing some Mario Rum Hacks, but, uh, well, Mario World Rum Hacks, but... Didn't find the drive to do so until very recently, I'd say. Well, until, until I've, at, at least I played Mario Maker 2. It's normal, right? So Mag Punch should be able to deal a lot of damage through it. Yep, there we go. Oh, rough skin. That's interest that's an interesting thing to have on a on a metamorph. On the so. Yeah, okay, so basically the um the French name for Ditto is Metamorph. Which is weird to to see Ditto on on the English version because I'm I'm like Metamorph. Metamorph is like it's like the better name for it, I'd say. <laughs> oh, well, see you later, I guess. Thanks for using one of my PP. Uh, my HP seems good enough for now. But yes, for Mario 64, there's like a lot of RAM hacks that I still need to play and a lot of very good ones as well. Also for Mario World as well, so yeah. I don't know if, I, if I'd if i want to... Maybe, maybe actually. Maybe what I could do is have a... Oh wait, can I just do Vine Whip for you? Yeah, Vine Whip is more than enough. Can I just do like a Mario 64? Like do do Yumi King on the Monday and then do Mario 64 on the Tuesdays. Hmm. That would be one more day into my schedule, and that would be too bad for me. Mike Punch should be good against them. Boink. 
Oh, Break Break would have been better. But my punch is fast, so... More Mackie. <laughs> mind like doing more streams the main problem i had with doing more streams before was because i oh ouch <gasps> oh oh don't freeze please okay we're good okay i mean i'm going to switch to turn of pokemon <laughs> I can't, I can't switch. I can't escape either. Eh. Let's see all it for now. Yeah, it's it's affected by bind, so I can't. I can't keep it here. Uh, let's use break break instead. There you go. But yeah, the main reason why I stopped doing, like, I, before, before, like, one or two years before, I did six streams a week for roughly six to eight hours. So, yeah, you can imagine that this, this was kind of stressful and had a lot of problems associated with it. So I decided like on a lighter I lighter stream schedule and I had like much many many less uh, problems with it this way Oh wait I might have done a goof here maybe poison tail will work Nope never mind Ah huh? doesn't deal damage we good just, just double slap them. But the problem, the problem in doing like a stream like six days a week or five days a week was that I also had like the stress of having to to make some other content on the side, and I had no clear way. As to how I wanted to do it. I had no... No, uh... Real ways to... To decide on how to do that. And... The more I went, the, the less problems I had with... Doing that. Okay, poison should be, should be effective against rest, right? No, it is not. Weird. Maybe it's grass poison, but in that case, yeah, yeah. Anyway. So yeah, doing more streams was not necessarily the problem. It's It was the, the stress behind having to make those streams being worthwhile. Like having the right, the right context, the right ideas linked to those days and not just do a stream just because her der I'm going to be plugging a video game and just stream trying to be to be a uh, to, to to in the hopes that I'm going to be discovered or anything like that I really didn't want to to have that kind of feel I wanted the streams to have like some kind of thoughts put behind those and to take like those extra days as days to make proper content that I could be improving my streams with. And now that I have like a certain understanding and a certain wish on how to improve those streams, now I have like a certain understanding as, as how to do so. Uh, I'll take the acro bike. Now I have like a certain understanding as to how to do so, 
uh, it's a lot better for me to to switch the schedule a little bit so I can do a little bit more or a little bit less. So I don't just do like a stream just because, hey, I want to do stream. Ha ha ha. I'm doing stream just because I want to. Oh, leftovers. Leftovers is strong. Is there a Pokemon that doesn't have anything on it? Unfortunately not. Cosmic has the, uh, the thing for the Vine. Vine Whip doesn't deal too much damage now that I realize. Yeah, 45. I might get rid of the, uh, the item to give the um, leftovers instead. Might be better, way better. Oh, Wiggle wow, level 18 Wigglytuff. That might be a little bit tough. Uh, <laughs> okay, that's good. We're going to be able to, to regen like the, uh, the HP we lost anyway, with the leftovers. Nice. Leftovers strong. You're in there? You just got back because you are having an internet problems for a while? Yeah, uh, so Life Potion got killed and we managed to, to get you inside a, uh, the, the road one, 108, I think? So yeah. Oh, I might not be able to deal with this one though. We'll see. Yeah. Ow! That's a crit! How much regen of LV? Ah, that's not much. I am going to switch to Joe for now. There we go. I think poison might work. Don't slack off. Yeah, rip LP. LP, LP went in a very, very bad way. Like, a slaking managed to, um, to do, like, a scary, a scary, uh, a scary glare at him, reduce his speed, and then use a bone meringue twice and murder them this way. I was like, no way. And so thus, oh, wait, no, I have done a goof. I have done a goof. I forgot that I didn't fight those two. Uh, that sucks. They only have one each, though. A Gorbis and a Quillfish. So the good thing is that I do have Vine Whip. Vine Whip will be able to deal a decent amount of damage to any of these. The main problem is that Solar Beam is going to take two turns to be able to deal any damage to them. Ooh. <laughs> it has Doom Desire. Oh no. Okay, thankfully Cosmic is going to be able to regen a little bit of health during that fight. Oh, Blizzard is going to deal a tiny little bit of damage to Cosmic and no damage to Joe. Yeah, literally no damage to Joe. <laughs> Hopefully, the, the team has avenged Potion already. Yeah, Gorbis is out of the question here. Yeah. All right, please don't use... Okay, we're good. Oh. That would have been horrible if we managed to one-shot the... Uh, the Quillfish on the first hit. 
That would have been a Pokemon loss straight away. Okay, so we technically could go and fight the gym here. Oh, there's also the... Ah, uh... oh, there's plenty... There's plenty of roads as well we could catch a Pokemon in. Like this route here, we have... We have no Pokemon caught yet. So we technically could catch one. What's the trainer heal for again? I don't remember. This is like the battle tower, right? Oh, I do need some awakenings, please. I am cruelly lacking those right now. What I like to have is at least 10 of each. Status removing things. Status removing uh, items are way too useful. All right, let's take, let's take the, the family guy. Finally, a four. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Okay, that's that deals damage. Excuse me, what? Yeah, we should be able to deal with lots of. That doesn't get any damage. This is what's type. Oh wait, what do you have? Is this citrus? No, this is just an orange berry. So this is going to take us one more move afterwards. Yeah, we're good. Leftovers is going to mean a lot to us right now. <laughs> Alright, Halo, um, I think I can just use fly, uh, a fighting move against them. Yeah. Bonk. Cosmic grew to level 23. Guilty. A powerful pincer attack that may cause fainting. You know what? It's better than self-destruct. Because even though this is this is like a hundred percent accuracy with two hundred power move, I'll take the guillotine. I'll take the guillotine. Oh, it's a slow bug. That's going to be easy. Right away. Where's it? I thought she had more than, than just one Pokemon, apparently. Apparently not. Alright. The Whooper is... Is going to have a good whooping. I didn't see the name of the Pokemon. I mashed it a little bit too too fast. Uh, that's oh, that's still good. We should still be able to uh, to vine with that. And the leftovers are. Oh wait, I missed. No. Ouch. That one hurts. Anyway, there we go. I wonder if you can do something like lock on guillotine. Like if I could teach lock on to to cosmic, and then use guillotine right afterwards. Ooh, ooh. 
Okay, that's going to be a brick break. So far, so far we are we are still like in a good sp spot compared to to what happened before. What does lock on do? Lock on lets you um lets you completely lock on into an enemy and guarantee the next move to be a uh, to 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 hit. If I remember correctly, at least. Ouch! No. Oh no! No 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 no! Oh! I'm out. Okay, that should deal less damage to to them. <gasps> Why did you crit? Yeah, that's much better. How many times can you use that move? I think it's five, right? This has to be at the limit, a limit of five. I'm going to, I'm going to use a super potion just in case. Just in case this could, this could crit. Normally, if, even if it's crits here, it shouldn't be. It shouldn't deal too much damage to us. Okay, okay. We're good. But what the heck, man? Alright, is it? The match will raise back. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That that is actually cool. Uh, who can we give it to? Not nobody yet. We finally got some Marshall Brace back. Nice, nice, nice. I'm going to be going to <laughs> into the tower to heal myself. Thank you very much. Alrighty. Oh, wait, I don't have the rock smashing. Okay, so I need to get to Moville. To the east of Moville, I think. Wait, isn't there like a way I can get some Pokemon from here? No, there is none yet. So this road doesn't have any Pokemon places where I could just gather any Pokemon here. Okay. So instead, let's head to the right. Go, Cosmic! Give a whooping! Just one HP left. <laughs> Big it sword. Oh, the last LTTPR seed was rough, man. We couldn't get the Baggett Sword to save our lives. Like, we had to do the entire game with the Fighter Swords. We found the Master Sword at the end, and only the end. was ultra, ultra, ultra rough. 
Like a seed, a seed that would normally take me right around, I'd say, three or four hours tops. That seed took me eight hours to finish. It was unbelievable. And the worst part, it wasn't even, it wasn't even the fault of the, the cross world. Because I didn't mind the cross world. It was the random damage that just murdered me. I think I, I should I should just let the one hit kill mm -hmm. mod be super low in crowd control and just put normal damage. <laughs> or at least shuffle damage. Shuffle damage isn't that bad. Random damage, however, is is definitely rough. Because shuffle, shuffle damage just means that you are going to take to take half of the damage if you find yeah, an armor. So if you find like the blue the blue armor, you you're going to take half of damage. If you find the red one, you're going to take a fourth of the damage. But in randomized damage in LTTPR, you're just going to be. You're just going to, to die. Yeah, yeah, just, yeah. You're just, the, the, the enemies the enemies will deal a certain amount of damage. You're going to be like, oh yeah, they deal that amount of damage. And then you get an armor and you're like, oh no, what does what does that in me do now? What do I do? Can't plan around random damage, yeah. 18 hearts of damage, yeah. 20 hearts of it can deal it can deal 20 hearts of damage and there is nothing you can do against that uh brick break should be good enough against this oh but missed whoops oh but missed as well shopping hmm i can just use uh Mag Punch here. Big Break dealt a lot of damage, so I can just do Mag Punch instead. Crystal League route to level 25. Trying to learn Taunt. Taunt is like... Only using attack moves. Uh, nope. Thank you. Let my melody rock your soul! Oh, come on! How come there's, there's so many flight and grass types here? Flight poison, flight grass. I have so much trouble dealing with this. So yeah, lock on. Next attack is definitely going to hit. So... Switch into Joe. Revenge. Oh no. Oh wow. Actually, okay, it's, it's because it crits. I was going to say it dealt a lot of damage, but no, it's because it just crits. There we go. Joe saves the day. Oh, Blaziken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just keeping Joe there. You are going to doy. Oh, unless he uses Thunder Punch. No, okay, that's good. Didn't deal too much damage either. Hydro Pump. And there we go. Wait, isn't the, the Rock Smash just supposed to be to be right around here? Or maybe maybe it's one of the houses. Maybe it's right here. Let's see. Rock Smasher? Yay. Rock Smasher. Okay, so we do have Rock Smash. The question is... Okay, I can teach it to Cosmic. Which is good and all, but... It's not good. I'm not going to teach you to Cosmic. However, 
However, I'm going... I might teach it to Joe instead. The reason is because double slap is not exactly what I would want from a, a move. Rock Smash may be way better for us. So Joe now has Rock Smash. Alrighty! Let's save the Pokemon to the Pokemon Center and see what we can do. So now we can head to the north of... This, ah, uh, maybe not. Can we actually use Rock Smash without... No, we cannot use Rock Smash without the badge. So we have to do the badge before we do this. So before we do the arena here... Before we do this thing, we are going to be heading off to the west side and fight some trainers there. Get the berries. And there is some grass off to the side. We can catch a Pokemon there. So this is what we're going to be doing first. Let's see what we can catch over here. Ah, Gorbis. I want to leave that away. I want to leave that away. Unfortunately, no Pokemon for, for us in this route. Alright, Yanma. Wait, is that another stinking... Ah! Oh. Flying bug types. Yep. It has Ice Punch. What is this? Ah, uh, let me switch to Joe. Fashion dying damage. Took the Doomsday attack. Whoa. Oh no! Maybe I'm thinking of Destiny Bond. Maybe Destiny Bond is the one I was thinking of instead of this. Doom Desire is just a free turn attack, okay. Joy is kinda slow, but I know that's because he has the Macho Brace on. He has strong stats. Because it has like a good growth, but the uh, speed is slow. Hello there, Claire. How are, how are you doing? How are you doing? How's the things? Sounds like you, IRL. <laughs> Joe has strong stats and he's fast. Wait, can I use fight against them? Yeah. Get out of here! Doing alright, eating pizza and assembling your new bed frame. Nice. Is this going to hurt? Should. What kind of pizza are you eating? And what kind of a bed frame are you assembling? Like, is it like a wooden bed frame? A metal bed frame? Wow, we have many, many mons here. This is going to be a nice little... A nice little leveling section, yeah. And because I have leftovers, I'm not going to be taking too much damage either. A vegan buffalo chicken. Hmm. Wonder how... I really wonder how you can make, like, chicken... Like, meat-based... 
things out of vegan vegan ways. Like, I'm really interested in seeing how you can reprodu reproduce those. Yeah, with soy. Soy is, is one of the things we actually use here as well, but... Um... Like some other some other things, I'm really interested in seeing how you would do so. I think I think it's with tofu, tofu is is one of the uh, the things you can do to reproduce meat, right? Well, to to reproduce the taste of meat. It's either plant soy or tofu. Yeah. Okay. That's interesting. I would I would kind of like to, to try it out one day. I still I still I still love my meat, so I can't I can't say I'm going I'm going to be like I'm going vegan. I I I'll, I'd be depressed doing so. Uh, but I still want to try it out. Like if I if I can like something that is similar to it that has like the same taste, the same texture, I could be like yeah, let's. Let's do this. I don't mind if I if I have like a good subsi substitute to it. I won't. I won't mind. You recommend the Beyond Burger if you want to try something again. I don't think the Beyond Burger would be some unless unless it's something that uh, that can be reproduced by. By making it yourself. I don't think it would be something here in Europe. But I'll try. I'll try to see if I can find it here. Alright. Many people running here. Oh, that's Latios. Yeah, it's, I'm, I'm definitely interested in trying out like different, different things about the cuisine, different ideas, and different. <laughs> that one hurts. I'm going to try one guillotine. They shouldn't hurt normally. It actually works. It actually worked. <laughs> By the way, this is a 30% move. 30% move to... 30% to, to, to accu 30 accuracy move, rather. I, ca I can't believe this hit. I can't believe this move hits. Wow. Now that was improbable. It becomes more accurate the higher the, the user's levels compared to the foe. Is this, is this it for all one hit KO moves? It's still, it's still 30 base, though. It's still 30 base. Okay, Break Break should be able to just smash this one. Bam. I wonder how much, how much the, uh, the, um, accuracy improves depending on the level. Like how the formula works for for these kinds of moves then. Latios was at level 17? 17, 18? So it wasn't that far high either. Less than 10. It can be a 100% accuracy. The level difference is high enough. I see. 
Oh, this is going to get violent. Cosmic Stroke! Crystal is becoming strong as well, but still no evolutions yet. We already have our Pokémon, so... Well, we have uh, uh, encountered a Gorbis and we killed it. So, yeah. Vine Whip. Smash. Smoke Ball? What does... Is this just for bug types and whatnot? Let's see. Oh no, no! Apparently it's a smoke ball for just escaping a battle. Right? Yeah. Ensures a fleeing from wild Pokémon. Yeah, it's 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 kind of a uh, of a weird name. And also, hey, Dakash. Welcome. It's it's kind of weird of a weird name. Uh, maybe Vine Whip will work against this one. Yeah. Pit Missile? Is that a bug move? Ouch! It's gonna deal like 45 tops to us. We need to be careful about that. Hopefully we can hit him before... Yeah, there we go. Mm, let's give Joe a little bit more uh, XP. Cosmic is becoming quite strong. Oh, oh of course. Oh, oh, of course. Had to send Squirtle. I really should have checked before sending. Sending Joe here. Oh, wow. Kind of resistant. Wait, just sleep it. I can just... Alright! Yeah, go ahead and sleep. I'm just going to use Solar Beam. <laughs> it's alright! You can just stay asleep. I won't hit you up until my Solar Beam. It's all okay. It's all fine. Alright. Uh, we haven't done that double battle with the, the two ladies here, so... Hey, I don't know why I decided to call it like a... Fish. If I see if I see a setting sun, does it want me to go, want to go home? Yes. Laying back in the green grass. Oh, it's so 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 nice. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's sometimes, yeah. Could chat again. No. Don't know if there's something I can do with uh, with them. Golbat is so desirable. Eh, no. Uh, I kind of like the Nidoran. The, the, the female Nidorans. No. Ball! It's so exciting. <laughs> is, the, is this guy a dog? <laughs> the ball is so exciting. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> That's about it, I think. <laughs> Wait, did we... <laughs> I didn't even know... I don't even remember anymore, Sly. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to save here, though. Man. We have two badges. Still... The third one is coming very soon, but... I want to get a little bit more levels before we tackle the gym. Just making sure that we are not getting destroyed afterwards. 
All right, so with Joe, I should be able to deal with the... Oh, no. So with Joe, I should... Uh, with Cosmic, I should be able to deal with the Tentacruel. With Joe, I should be able to deal with the Ninjask. Wait, that's only dealt no damage. I thought this was a water type. Maybe it's because it's a poison. Maybe it's because it's water and poison. It's been a long, 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 long while since I played... Since I played any Pokemon other than Sword and Shield. This was actually my last... The last one I completed before... Before doing Sword and Shield. I hated... I hated Platinum. I tried X and Y and just left them be. Um... I then tried to do Black and White and just couldn't... Couldn't do them at all. Oh, whoops. Why did I do Hydro... Hydro Pump? That was dumb. And then I had Sun and Moon on the, the 3DS. Like, I, somebody gifted it to me. And I was like, yeah, I'm going to be, to be playing it maybe. And then I, I played it for like 20 minutes and dropped it afterwards. Because I just couldn't get caught in the story, can get caught in the game at all. Which I felt I felt really bad for because I wanted to to, to, to be able to enjoy it. Because somebody gifted it to me. It's it's kinda rude to not play a game that somebody gifts you. And I tried I tried really hard to play it and then just couldn't get onto it. And then I got to Soul and Shield and I actually was kinda surprised like for the for the bad rap it got on on the internet and like all of the bad things that people say about it, it's actually a decent Pokemon game and I kind of don't understand why people are raging so much against it. Of course, there's one thing I don't like about it and that's the DLCs. The DLC policy for for Pokemon is bad. I am not endorsing it whatsoever. But the rest of the game isn't too bad once you you come to terms with it. I understand like a, a couple of the points that people make about it though. Uh, the um, the main hub for catching Pokemons and whatnot being too intrusive compared to the um, to the zones. Like you, you don't have like that many. Oh wait, bag is full. You have a limit on how many things you can carry in the bag. I didn't know. I well, guess I am going to be throwing and selling some things away then. Well, th not throwing, but at least selling things. But yeah, I can understand like some of the points, like the 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 main zone, the main catching zone, being a little bit too intrusive and. That reduce the amount of roads and places you can head to. That reduces like a lot of the... I wouldn't say novelty, but... A lot of the... Of the places you could get to. Like you... Do, you instead of having... A lot of... Ah, that sucks. I don't want to be selling that. Why can't I sell the retro mail? That's weird. Uh, ba -ba -ba -bum. I don't want to be selling this tiny mushroom. Tiny mushrooms would be great to have. I guess I'm going to put some other things into the... Okay. Into the PC. So yeah, about the, the the catching zone. Instead of having like many many places you could head to, like a desert, a volcano, um, a tundra, or any many many different places you could be headed to. Um, yeah, you can't you can't have that, and you have like one mishmash of many different grass type zones, and 
all of the Pokemon are grouped there, and that's kind of dumb. Like, I, I definitely agree with that sentiment there. However... I still feel like this is a cool idea in itself. But it would have been better if there was more than just two zones, two grass type zones that had like some some changing weather. That would have been much better if that, that was the case to begin with. Okay, we should be good. Let me place the Thunderstone and Firestone inside there. And we should be good on the rest. I am going to place the rare candy inside the, the thing as well. Don't want to be leveling up a Pokemon yet. Alright. We ought to be good now. There's still a couple of trainers I want to fight on the west side though, so... Isn't there like a... No, there is nothing there. But there is an item right here. Sacred Ash. I wonder what it does. And one Quality Berry. Allow me to evaluate if you have raised your Pokémon properly. I'm going to be wiping your entire team of six. If you have six. I think I think she has six. Either four or six. I'm going to be wiping them either way. Cosmic Stonk. Let's change it back to Joe. Joe needs a little bit more XP as well. should be good enough. Yeah, close. Whoa. Okay, that didn't tell any damage. <laughs> I thought that was going to be way scarier than this, but no. We're good. But yeah, Pokemon Sword and Shield wasn't as bad as people make it seem to be. That's my take on it. Mm, I'll use Rock Smash. One thing I absolutely don't understand though is the hate for Hop. Hop is one of the best rivals altogether in any Pokemon game. Like the way they wrote, they wrote Hop overall. Ow. The way they wrote Hop, Hop overall in in Soul and Shield is easily the best way to write a rival in any kind of Pokemon game. Because as the as the main player, as the main player, you're going to be destroying anything. Like you're going to be winning all the time. And the game is made in such a way that you're going to be winning and winning and winning and winning and winning and winning and, winning and you're, you're not going to find like any kind of of bad threat. Even in, in all the Pokemons, even if in like Pokemon Red, even Pokemon Silver, like the the rivals, they're going to lose to you. And they're going to be like, oh, I'll get you next time. Oh, smell the elite. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's dumb. They're, they're, they, they don't have like a shred of personality and they're just going to be like, Oh yeah, I'm suddenly here, I'm going to try and kick your, your butt and I'm going to get my butt kicked and then I'm off to you, off to do my thing. Whereas Hop tries to be, to be there, tries to grow alongside you and realizes that since you as the player, as the main protagonist, as the main, the biggest champion of all, you are always going to take the first place, and you are you are uh, an insurmountable wall. They realize that they cannot beat you, they cannot grow, 
because you are here. And so thus, they decide to, to, to realize... Yeah, well, he decides to, to... To figure out a different way to live. A different way to grow. A way that he can be useful to you and other people. Like, to, to be useful to the world. And that's because you, as the player, you mercilessly and recklessly destroyed him and destroyed all of his dreams. And yet, at, this, at the end of the day, even though because it becomes, it becomes depressed, he tries to change his team during the entire game. He tries to he tries different things. He even removes his main Pokemon for a while. Like any kind, you, can, you you see any kind of rival in the in the main series, they keep their main Pokemon away about alongside the way to to fight you, even if it doesn't work, even if it if they they don't have like a like a good advantage against you, they still they will still keep it and try to fight fight you with it. But he tries to change. He tries to remove it from the team and keep him aside and. That's something that's something that's that really stood apart from the other rivals. He tries to change, he tries to, to do things, but because you as the player are here, he will never be able to grow and become the champion. And that's when you realize that it cuts deeply. It cuts deeply because you as a player, have you done the right thing? Like you became champion, but at what cost? You're carrying the dreams of your rival that you have broken alongside the way. But even then, he decides to try and become a professor to be able to support you even better. And that, I think, is pretty beautiful. So I really, really don't get the hate for Hop as a whole. All right. Wally is one of the, the rivals I don't understand either. Like he's like, oh yeah, I'm, I'm I I'm I'm all weak and I'm trying to have like my rolls. Like I'm 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 all weak and I'm going to be trying to have to be the champion and my rolls is going to do the work for me. No, this is not how it works. This is never how it works. Yeah, Hop, Hop is like the best the best rival I've ever encountered in any Pokemon whatsoever. Well, actually, no, that's I I may be lying about that. The favorite rivals I've seen in Pokemon are not in games. The favorite rivals are, uh, I've seen in Pokemon are in the manga, actually. Pokemon... I think it was Evolved, Unleashed... Uh, I don't remember the um, Advanced. I think it was the name of that one. But yeah, the, the, the Pokemon manga is actually super, super good. And it's not like, oh, you're going to be throwing a Pokemon into my face. I'm going to be throwing a Pokemon at your face. And those two Pokemons are going to be fighting with us behind, just throwing some orders. No, they actually fight with the Pokemons. They fight on Pokemons. They use their Pokemons as weapons. It's actually very, very engaging. And I didn't know that this was such a possibility for a for Pokemon as a whole. And what the heck? Isn't this supposed to be... What? I don't remember this being the gym. This gym's awesome. I got puzzles. Isn't it fun? Yeah, I'm going to break break. Bonk, bonk, bonk. But yeah, I went, I went on the little tangents about half here. But that's how much I love the character as a whole. 
character is really is is insanely good and like I wish I wish a lot more people actually realized that. It's no fun to lose. It can be fun to lose if you do it well. I love shiny things. I can I can believe that. <laughs> Shinies. Alright, break break should be enough to deal with this. Monk. Garlic, no problem. Ah, three hits should be good to deal with Gloom. Ooh. I actually didn't do damage. That's good. Oh, that's a critical? I wish I had that before. Way before. Wait, isn't... Isn't this like a dragon type? Even a normal dragon type. I'm going to do break break. It's that vine whip. Oh no, sleep powder. Okay, I'm going to try Mag Punch once. Yeah, fast asleep. If it deals a lot of damage to me. Oh, it has Flame Wheel. Extra Sensor is not going to deal too much to me. That was with a crit. So the leftovers are going to heal me anyway. Hey, Cosmic Walker. Nice. So I can deal with you. Cosmic is still like in great shape. Do I need to go for a Pokemon Center yet? Uh, this is a fight type, but fights can be used against fights, so break break. Give a little bit of XP to Joe. Hmm, that is a problem. Uh, I think I could just use Solar Beam. Solar Beam might. Oh, Meteor Mash. That was that was close. Yeah, there we go. Goodbye. <gasps> wow. One HP left. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Crystal Lee is at 29. Torment? Isn't Torment like a... It's a decent move. It's a decent move, but Content and Flash are also needed. A Flash I could teach you to somebody else, so... But the problem is that I can't I can't unlearn items right now. I forgot about this this little particularity about this game. Ah, uh, could still fight. A bay leaf. Bring. Bring the witness to testimony, my left. Order! Order in the court! I kind of want to, uh, to try out um, Ace Attorney Investigations. Wait, no, it's not Investigations. It's the Great Ace, Ace Attorney 2. I've done the first one on 3DS. And was was a really really good game. I really liked the uh, the old the year old English style of the game compared to the to the usual I don't know Japanese contemporary Japanese American ish <laughs> vibe they usually have into the uh, Ace Attorney series. So I'm kind of interested in trying out. 
the second game. Whenever I get my hands on it. I think they they have they have made like a French a friend uh, a, a French a French translation a, a fan translation of two, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I need to find with this. If I have fight moves, I'm going to be effective against those. I could use Hydro Pump against Charizard. Oh, scale swap? What? What, 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 what? Oh, okay, it's not a type swap. It's just the, the, uh, the different abilities. Okay. That's good me for a moment. I was like, hey, he, he, he's, he, he's a water type and all of a sudden I'm, I'm, I'm like a fire type? What? <laughs> no, it's not. It's not going to work like that. We're good. One last trainer remaining. And that is you, Blaine? No, it's not Blaine. Just remember, it's Watson. Blaine is the... The seventh gym leader in... Red and blue? Red, blue, yellow? But it does look like... No, actually it doesn't look like too similar to, to Blaine. Bank. What is what is up? Aerial blast? What is up with the monks? Just just surviving one HP. Yeah, yeah, the super portion is not going to help you here. It's going to die. But what is up with the monks just surviving one HP? Dang it! Uh, Eagle buff is going to get destroyed. Don't think the fairy type is on into into Verandos. Unless they updated They updated they updated the typing slots. I don't think there are any fairies. There are any fairies in there. I think fairies was uh, a new type in X and Y. If I remember correctly, at least. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Yeah, that's not good. Oof. Ah, it's not too bad. I could fight this. Wait, can I actually guilt in this? Oh, oh, oh there, there, there we go. Goodbye. See you later. Cosmic Strunk. Yeah, Pikachu is going to get destroyed. Level 24, though. That is kind of good. Break Break should deal lots of damage to it, but it has, like, a lot of possibilities to, to hurt us. Ooh, double team is also a problem. I will use Mac Punch just in case. My accuracy might be a deal... Oh, wait, no. That's a citrus berry. I have to use another bird break. Okay, supersonic mist, and I can just do Mac Punch to finish it. Unless he uses an item, but that's not the case. That is over. Let's go. Let's do this. Dynamo badge from Watson. <laughs> screw me. <laughs> oh, screw me. I got... I got a sand attack from this. Ah, oh, that hurts. That hurts a bit. That hurts a bit inside.
That hurts a little bit inside. I really don't like that my my overlay like only captures my my stick. So here is when I move the the stick on my controller, and this is when I move on the D-pad on my controller. So I really don't like that it only captures one of the two and not the two of them. Because when I use the the GBA, I, uh, well the, uh, the the GBA emulator, I like to use both the stick and the D-pad. But only one of them is captured onto the... Onto the thing. Alright, I have Wally and the enough. Uh, I think this is a double battle. Do we have everything ready against the double battle? Yes. Yeah, there's there's a lot of of Pokemon uh, of Pokemon ROM hacks of Mario ROM hacks of Zelda ROM hacks that I might be interested in trying out. There's also, there's also a lot of them I don't want to be doing like on stream, so I might attempt to do those like off stream and have some fun with those. Like um, thus far, I've been I've been doing Mini Mario 64 as a as an off stream thing, and good lord, Mario 64 Mini Mario 64 is brutal because all it does is it transforms your like Mario into its a tiny version of them with a with a with a tiny voice being like Wait, whoa. <laughs> and the jumps you do are stupidly small. Like, if you do a triple jump, you jump a door and a half, and that's about it. So that's pretty fun, and... And it makes a lot of the, um, of the original game, like, very, very hard to deal with. Because, so for example, let's say the, the Invisible Cap's secret star. Well, a red coin star. This thing is was nearly impossible to do. Oh, whoops. Uh. Attack. <laughs> there we go. I'm a ghost now. Attack. Attack. Here. Here. Attack. Attack. This this is a ghost. I completely lost uh, what what I was. Gonna... Yeah, about Mini Mario 64. Yeah, so the red coin star in the invisible cap in Mini Mario 64 was a pain in the half. Because normally you you're supposed to use. Um, seesaws, you're supposed to use platforms to jump across and whatnot. The problem is, all of that was replaced by boxes, and those boxes are placed in such a way that you have to do triple jumps plus ball bounces with perfect angles in order to get there. So yeah, that was, that was an experience. And there were lots of, of stars like that. Uh, the wall jumps will uh, wall jumps will count. I don't remember the exact name for this, but that was in Cool Cool Mountain. That one was same thing. A uh, triple jump into a wall kick with perfect angle with a camera that you can't place properly, so you had to lock the camera so that you had the perfect angle for it. And then you needed to grab the ledge at a perfect way so that you clipped through instead of grabbing it. Like it, 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 it was, it was ridiculous.
And I'm like, I think I'm like halfway, no, I'm halfway or, or a third of the way in. I think I have like 50, 50 stars or something on Mini Mario 64. Something I wish I wish I could do is like being able to to play some to play and discover some games like on the Game Pass with with other people onto onto the stream like as a as a chill way to to just relax and and discover some games together like play some co-op games and whatnot co-op or it could be. It could be some some games that are oh wow 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 go on and flex wouldn't you would you a freaking celebi right here right now and with blast burn i am out wait actually i think i can guilt in this Yep, but there we go. Punch. It is a one hit kill. Oh, bounce. What is this? Bounces up and down the next turn. May paralyze. Okay, so Mike Punch has a ton of BP. But, at the same time, Break Break has more power and more accuracy, destroys barriers as well. So my punch is just to be able to, to hit first. But I don't really need that. Cosmic is like pretty fast already. And this would grant me an, a flight type move, which will grant me access to just destroying bugs. Destroying bugs is something I desperately need right now with Cosmic. So I think this is the move. Alright, now I can biggity bounce with Cosmic. Wait, I have not encountered a single... Yeah, this is a new road. I could technically fight... Some months here. Yeah. Uh, Crystal Lily has some weak moves, right? Let's see. So Cosmic is 62, 61, 60, 48, 76. Here's a speedy boy. Um, Jugong. Joe is not that high. Like compared compared to Cosmic, Cosmic is actually insanely strong. Dugong is still not that strong, however. Even with a Metro Brace, which reduces speed by a lot. Personally, is even weaker. And when do you evolve? How do you evolve? How does a normal evolve? Like, it's level 30, it's still not evolved yet. And I don't have that many Pokemons that can deal with it, but I think that having a Crystal Lily be on, on the front here might be a little bit better if I want to try and catch a Pokemon. Moo won the battle. Hey, <laughs> congrats, Moo. Can you please, please, please be frozen? I would love if I could f just freeze you. Man, that hurts. You decided the one battle. The one battle to one shot, to one shot them on. was this one.
That was a flipping rake water. Just decided to one shot a rake water. Just like this. One more? Just in case? Yay! By the way, there is there is an extra rule I have for this playthrough. If I ever find a shiny, I will have to catch it. There is a shiny clause. If there is if there is a Pokemon I am encountering in the wild, even though I have already like done the thing, I will catch it just to get the shiny. Yeah, I can't get past. I can't get past. Uh, I didn't want to use Crystal Lily here, but... Lizard is going to destroy this thing anyway, right? Look at that power. Uh, Aerodactyl, I can just use Cos... No, Joe. Joe is the better choice. Hydro Pump, and then I just destroy this thing. Wait, why is Covet? What? What was Covet? I, this is the first time I've ever seen that attack. What was the, um... Uh... What was the point of that attack? Hello. All right, seal. Wait. Vice grip should be the, the, the choice here. Yeah. Then I'll switch it to another one. Gachunk. Yeah, Blastican is going to be destroyed by Joe. Unless it has Thunder Punch. Ouch! For level 16, that dealt a lot. Wait, we should still be fine with Elakazam here. Rock Smash is not going to be useful. I think Poison Tail should deal a lot of, dam a lot of damage to him. I think they're, they're, they're vulnerable to poison. No? weird. I thought po Psy Psychic type was weak to poison. <gasps> it detected my poison tail! Ouch. We're still going to get kicked. Oh, just barely to be able to reach 27. Come on. I'm going to be healing Joe a little bit and then putting him back to... ...to the front. Putting putting Joe back to the front might be better. Alright, this... wait! Crystal Lily is like level 32. I am... ...not sure. That's what I want to do with Crystal Lily. Like, what is the name of this of this mon? I need to know. What do I need to evolve a new mole?
Let's see. No more. Oh, just one more level. One more level. Good thing I just checked. It, it evolves at level 33. Oh, that's a cliff fable. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is going to kill. This is going to kill. This is going to kill. You know what? Yo, no. I tried. <laughs> eh. Yeah, all of these moves are going to, to murder the Clefable. I'm going to try still. Please don't kill it, please don't kill it, please don't... Okay, we're good. But the defense dropped. Name the Cliff Fable. Ah. Uh. Claire Fable. There we go. This way, Claire is in as well. Well, good thing we got the Cle the Clefable, <laughs> and not this. Hmm. Wasn't I should deal damage to this, right? Lock on. Oh no. Oh no, that doesn't deal any damage to it. Uh, hydro pump maybe. <gasps> <gasps> We almost lost Joe. So lock on doesn't make lock on doesn't make the the one hit KO attacks a hundred percent possible. We almost lost Joe to this. Two Rost Berries. Do we have, like... Mm. Let's just fight some more. I took a Pokemon and Fiery Bath! I don't know why I read Swindler instead of Kindler. Oof. Wait, is that an attack that deals as, uh, as much damage as the level of the... I need to see. Yeah, it is! If you're level 18, you'll deal uh, 18 damage. If you're level 25, you'll deal 25 damage. I think it's, it's how it works, right? Yeah, let's just do Hydro Pump. Because it has guillotine. Come on. Just one more level, please. And wait! There are some Pokemons I could get here. Hey, salty! Salty is selling us right now. Uh, Rock Smash should be good. This is a normal flight type, right? Hmm, wasn't good enough. 
rain continues to fall. I could technically do... Wait. I could technically do Hydro Pump. But the problem is that I only have one left. So I'm going to be switching Joe to something else afterwards. Ah, oh, I now I regret it. Um, actually, no, it's not that bad. Duck Shrio is going to be weak to Cosmic anyway. I don't understand why they went from 1 to 3 as an evolution. Like, they did. Did they just forget the 2? They did, they did a reverse valve. They forgot that the 2 was there, but they went for the 3 straight away. Maybe that's what valve needs to do from now on. They need to forget about, about the number 2 and do the 3rd series. The 3rd in the series right after. Actually, Nintendo got it right. I guess. What happened to the tune? Nobody will ever know. But there's a third one in the series. <laughs> Alright, what's on the road? Oh, that is not a bad Pokemon there. That is actually a decent one. With Protect. On top of that. And slack off. Let me try and use Poison Tail instead. Okay, it doesn't deal like it has a super defensive move set. <sighs> Ooh, that was a crit. All right, Weezing, you are mine. Kachonk, no! He's going to slack off now, come on. Bonk. Oh, wow. Yeah, it has a super defensive moveset. Something absolutely wonderful. But to capture a Pokemon with it is a major pain. He's super tanky as well. Don't slack off, please. I think it's used like all of the slack offs, right? Please don't crit. Okay, protect. That means I will never ever crit. Anyway. There's like l zero chance that I'm going to die in this fight. Because of his moveset. I could teach him like better, better attacks. Are you kidding me? Nothing happened there, and nothing will ever happen. Everything is perfectly fine. Everything is perfectly okay. Show me how tough you have toughened up your Pokémon. Everything is tough. Cool trainer Joe Dark. It's Joe versus Joe Dark. I'm going to go to use Solar Beam. Oh, Stance Sports sucks, though. 
There's a chance it might lock me from... Oh no. It's charmed now. It's paralyzed and charmed. <sighs> Alright, Crystal show me what you got. No, not Hyperfang. No Hyperfang, please. Uh, Vice Rift. Let's go. That didn't deal damage. And it, it managed to stun for me again. I hate those Pokemons. Blizzards. It can't move. It can't move! Ah, there we go. That's not going to be dealing much, I think, because it's water type. But, hey, we'll see. Oh, that's... Never mind, that crit. I'm okay with that. Mmm... Cosmic will be able to do something against that thing. Break Break should be able to deal like a lot of damage to it. Oh, especially with a critical hit. Ah, still not good enough though. Normally the Lapras should give me enough for the level 33 for Crystal Lily. Attack missed. But Chopin. Chopin is a long attack. For what it does, it's such a long attack. You're gonna die. Why are you making me wait so much? Vine Whip. Oh, oh, oh no, because Joe Dark uses potions. Crystal Lily grew to level 33. Let's go! Alright. Ba, 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 ba. And build some. That's not what I wanted. How do you evolve? Let's see. I need the Gen 3 decks. There we go. I need a sunstone for this? Oh no, this is the last evolution for for this tree. Oh no. Well, that is that is kind of sucky-ish. Let's see the sets on Belosum here. Actually, the defense is actually pretty good. Like what the heck this defense? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? 83 on defense. And still has more attack than in any other Pokemon I have in my team. What is this? I don't mind. It's slow in speed. Compared to uh... To Cosmic, which is like blazing fast. But so much defense. So tanky. The rest doesn't matter that much. Clefable White might have like a lot of... Of defense later on. If I gave them the... XP share.
Alright, I want to try and get a Pokemon Center. As soon as I can. Is this like a arrest house? Yes! Arrest stop. Perfect. Exactly what I wanted. Do you need to take a rest? Full heal. But wait! You're not completely... You're, you seem like a little bit tired. Do you want to take a rest? <laughs> but wait! Your Pokemon is still tired. Do you want to still take a rest? <laughs> it's like looking look at myself in the mirror when I'm trying to look, to, to, to wake up at... Like at... Like four or five hours before I actually... I actually go in there and... Yeah. It doesn't work as expected. With Sacred Ash, fully? Wow, fully revived and restore all fainted Pokemon. That is insane. But useless, kind of useless because we don't have any fainted Pokemon. We can't have any fainted Pokemon. That's the, that's the whole point of a Nuzlocke. Now I'm going to take the XP share out of Crystalidy. I'm going to give it to Clefair, Clefable, Claire Fable. Let's take all the berries away. Because I'm an evil person like that. Don't even replant those. The world is going to burn behind me. We don't need any stinking berries. Well, more stinking berries, rather. Oh, I'm... I remember this. Is there any place where I could access a... A PC nearby? No. Uh, and there's nothing else that, that way. So I have to go all the way to the next village in order to do so. So let's fight you. I have to ask you for an engagement. Uh, lady, I, I'm, I'm sorry, but... I kind of like... Oh, magic coat. That's interesting. Still going to murder him, but that's interesting. First, we discuss. Then we have a date. Maybe, maybe I have like a couple of of interesting exchanges. But marriage is is a little bit further and down the line, you know. I don't want to be engaged just yet. This is a poison type? No, this is a grass or bug type, right? So I could just poison tail, yeah. Critical hit. That works. I don't critical that often with poison tail, even though it has like a, a high critical rate. Quote in quotes. Hello. Hello. What are you doing here? Oh, I'll rock and smash, rock and smash miss. What? Ooh. Okay, Shadow Ball didn't deal that as much damage as it did to Life Potion. <laughs> Wait, was it Life Potion? I think it was Life Potion that got murdered by Shadow Ball. No, it was it was Diamond Blade. It was Diamond Blade that got murdered by Shadow Ball. And I'm so sorry about him. Like, just bam. Came out of nowhere from a Waylord. Diamond Blade had no. No escape. Leech Life. How come do you know Leech Life? Oh, Leech Life is a bug type. Mm, never mind. I thought that was a grass type, so it was going to deal a lot more. But no. It's a bug type. Ah, 
All righty. So, Route 13. Oh, hello there, you beautiful thing. Hello there, you beautiful, beautiful thing. Please don't get killed. Oh, that is perfect. Oh, hello there, you beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Pokemon. Oh, that is kind of scary. So happy I got it. It's going to be sent to box one. Wait, we have six Pokemons already? Oh yeah, because we got the Claire Fable. Oh, I'm so happy. I am so happy. We are bringing we are bringing bringing Cajun into into the uh, the team though. That is a hundred percent sure. Oof. Oh, that doesn't damage. This might reduce my accuracy though. But still, this is going to kill. So we're good. But man. One Duneberry. I made a tea. <laughs> it's tea time. Oh, I am so glad I managed to catch one. Oh, don't. Okay, I was going to say, don't kill. <laughs> don't kill join exchange. <laughs> I'll be mighty sad if it's if it if it happens. Oh no, it's poisoned! Poison Joe! I am going to be using... <laughs> I'm not taking any risks here. Yeah? I'm going to be using a Silver Bob. Okay, that didn't deal any damage. This place here might be great for XP though. I can use. Let's go with Rock Smash for now. This should die first with the poison. And we shouldn't take the damage from the poison. Which then lets us use the berry for this. Which one is Petchaberry? Ah, I won that ball. I won that ball. I don't know what's in the ball. And I want to know what's in the ball. I might also regret it. Ah! No, I'm good. Oh, <laughs> hey! I got back my... <laughs> I got back my item. Oh, but I'm going to have a fight anyway. Whoops. Ah, that's going to be easy to deal with. 
one good old hydro pump and then there we go. He did. Oh, and that was a critical head as well. Oof. Claire Fable went to level 18. I do not want to be doing a double battle just yet. I might come back for that one later on. Hey, a hand hour. A Super Saiyan hand hour. Wow, that actually hurts. For level 16, that actually hurts. Yeah, Joe isn't that strong now anymore. Hey, I got the suit stack. Puff, 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 puff. Okay. So he's making blue flutes out of these. From out to the ashes, I leap. Hiya! I challenge me. It's a ninja boy. Oh no, that sucks. Please don't hurt yourself. I know you're strong, Joe. No! Well, I'm switching Joe out for Cosmic. Cosmic will destroy the Dodario. Oh wait, that wasn't enough. Wait, why does it try to do Nightmare when I'm not asleep? Is, was something wrong about... about its own IA? This is Zuba. Zubato. Oh, that doesn't deal damage. <gasps> oh. Thought I was going to deal a lot more damage than, than that. Kick from what I remember in crystal high jump kick was like super super strong. But maybe it got nerfed in Emerald. Pineco? What is this Pokemon? Oh this one. Yeah, I do remember you. It's a pine cone. But without a knee. Oh, Hello. It's great that you're making me flinch, because that means that I'm just going to be able to regain my, my health anyway. Uh, let's begin the bounce. Whee! Bonk. The Ninja Boy Cosmic has now been registered. Oh, Bone Rush. That might be a good TM to learn. Let's see. Because right now, all of the rest is not that good. Bone Tail can't be learned with any of these. I can't... I can't teach... Bone Rush with... Cosmic here. That's 90 accuracy for 25 power. The problem is that the rest of his attacks are actually decent. Right now, there's not that much I can't fight against with Cosmic.
So we're good on that front. Ah, just a single patch of grass. Oh, I'm Mr. Rivas. Look how cute this 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 one Pokemon is. And I'm sorry, but I'm going to also just I drop on you because I want to go to the village as soon as I can. <laughs> I'm super sorry. Goodbye. I want to get Cade as fast as possible. My name is Wow. Yes, my name is definitely Wow. All right, so I'm going to be depositing. Uh, let's see, Doso is not doing much here, unfortunately. So let's deposit Doso. I'm sorry, Doso. But Cadrian is definitely coming with us. And on top of this, we will bring. Uh, we will take the item, the XP, the XP share from uh, the Cle the Claire Fable, and give it to to Kadrin. So I'm, before, actually, before I do this, I need to to make sure of his of his stats. Yeah, it's four levels below Claire. It's almost as strong already. So I think I think this is a good decision, yeah. And his attacks are already pretty decent. Crab Hammer is good. Extreme Sensory is also good. Rage is not good, so I'm going to try and replace it with something else. I'm going to try and give them um, Poison Tail if it's possible. Not able, dang it. Bone Rush? Bone Rush would be great. At least Cut. Oh wait, but if I do give it Cut, it's not going to be able to unlearn it after a while. It sucks, but we'll have to wait for, for Cade to learn more things. Going to have to head off for the night, Cosmic? Absolutely no problem. Have a wonderful, wonderful time and have a wonderful, wonderful rest. Move tutor. Ah, I need hard skills. And of course, I can't buy these, right? Yup. I will buy a couple of Grey Bolts and a couple of Super Poosh. And a little bit more escape ropes. As for the rest, I don't mind. Meow! It's a Skitty. I love Skitties. Hmm. So the move tutor was there. All right. So now that we have, now that we have healed, we can bring Cade to a high level by fighting some of the dresses here. Well, dresses, some of the trainers. There you go. Dresses. Dresses the word, the French word for, for Pokemon trainer in French. That's why I was a little bit confused for a while. <gasps> it has thunder. Stinking Raikou. It has poison points. Dang it! Why do you have poison town points? That's gonna hurt. Please be poisons as well. That thing is supposed to have like a good amount of poison. 
All right, I'm not taking the risk. I am putting Cosmic on the line here. Actually, Crystal Lily, let's go. Crystal Lily is like mass, mass defense. This is not going to yield too much to Crystal Lily. Like, yeah, this has dealt like nine damage. <laughs> nine whole damage to Crystal Lily. And Joe is now level 29. Psy Wave. Attack. Attacks with a Psychic Wave of varying intensity. I don't like the idea of having different. Different power moves. Last time I tried this, this went very badly. Wait, this is a nice type. I keep forgetting this, but I think Ghost Ring is nice type. No? Is it not? Only a normal type? Hmm. The Cadrian is level 16. Wow, two in all. Two in all stats. Uh, Joe, how much health do you have left? 35, 34, 33, 32, 31, 30, 29, 28. Yeah, curing poison was my main priority here. Yeah. Switch Joe back to Cosmic. Joe is a little bit weak, unfortunately, right now. Cosmic is decently strong. Crystal is insane. Mm. Ray Rage should be able to deal against this. might be insanely strong afterwards as well but needs a little bit more XP to do so right now he's a little bit weak a tiny tiny little bit weak let's begin bounce submission <laughs> I will never submit <gasps> you identified me I did to fight this fist in your move. Cosmic is almost level 30. I think this is the latest, the last evolution for... For this branch, right? I think so. Could be wrong. Alright, there's a couple of things I can fight here. He's a fossil maniac. I'm getting dig. We must dig. Yeah, it's dig. I have to know. Okay, Cadrian is not able to learn it, but Crystal Lee and Joha are able to. We must dig. I have to know the power of my current attacks compared to to dig, though. Vice Grip is something I could get rid of because Cut deals almost as much damage and is slightly more accurate. Blizzard is going to destroy everything with it. And I don't have like any, any ground type moves. So using Dig on Crystal Lee might not be that bad of an idea. And it's 80 power, 95 accuracy. 
Plus, it's pretty much a, uh, an escape rope on command. So Crystal Lee doing a great job with, with getting like all of the Like it's my it's my swift my Swiss army army knife of sorts. Okay, so I need to go and and seek the boulders in the desert for some puzzles. should be able to deal against it. Bonk. Nice. Level 17. And still getting plus 2 on all stats. That's something that is going to get even better later on. Woof. Zuka. The accuracy is trash on this thing. Get it away from me. Get it away from me. Dear Rosso and Anna want to fight. Alright, it's Red Joyce and Porygon 2. Porygon 2 can deal with a brick break. How with the uh, Red Joyce, I have no clue. I think I could just use Dig against it. We'll see if it works. Break break will also work against it. Apparently it did. Perfect. Wait, white flute? Didn't I get did, was I supposed to get like a blue flute from the from the other thing, lose wild Pokemon. So can I can I use it here, like right there? Oh no no, that's not what I wanted to do. I thought it would, this was going to be like a, an instant. Oh hey, I'm going to have a Pokemon battle right now. Apparently not. It's just hey, this Pokemon that's going that are going to bug me even more now. <laughs> Whoops. Ah oh, dang it, I missed. But it also missed, so it's good. It's super effective. Yeah, Porygon 2. Cosmic is way more than enough uh, for dealing against this. Break, break. Let's go. And Kadrian is now level 19. Gravel, I think I can deal with this with Vine Whip. So far, this Nuzlocke is going very, very well. Like, this one Nuzlocke here. <laughs> third time's the charm. This is the third seed. This is going way better than, than before. The Brava. I like the design of this one. I I don't mind I, I don't I really don't like bugs in general, but I really don't mind the design on this on this one, man. 
it's embracing itself, but it failed. Bonk. I like how you can't you can't use Endure twice, so you just use a two-turn move and then all of a sudden they're just locked. Mawile should be also. Wait, that didn't deal damage? That's interesting. Bit paralyzed, so that works. Wait, did paralyze myself as well? No, just remove speed. Good to know. And since we have leftovers, we can deal with this with no problem at all. Okay, so that was not a a bug move, a bug or grass type. I thought that was going to be the case, but it's not. I do remember like one super cool upgrade. What is this? What is this about? A peculiar box made by itself co. Is this like something I need to give to the president in? I don't think so. I need to see what's what it does later on. Uh, but I do remember like a super classy mobile skin of sorts. Why it was like a um, a samurai. A samurai um, themed in my while, and that was super, super well made. Like the Pokemon was actually beautiful. I need to, to find to find it to find it again. That was really, really, really well made. Alright. Oh, hello there. I got a doll. Huh. I don't want to keep reading. I want to use a PC just just so I can get this doll you gave me out of my system. Ah, uh, fine. Like, can I go behind uh, the house? I don't think so, right? Oh, no, I can. So I'm getting those person berries. What else can we do here? There is a double battle. I do not want to handle... Um... Let's let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this double battle. Never mind. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? What is this? Why are you here? That was a lot of XP for, for Kadrian. That was cool. Oh, Blizzard is actually super effective against it. Oh, never mind. Well, goodbye, you. See you later. We destroyed them. They had like some, some crazy bonds, though. That was kind of scary. Angus can. Should be able to break right these. No problem. Kadrian grew to level 21. He's getting some crazy stats already. And also, unfortunately for him, his HP is in the funny number zone. <laughs> That's the most unfortunate you could have him be right now. 
<laughs> oh, that isn't, that isn't very effective. Interesting. Why is it not effective against Gengar? Let's use Flying Type instead. Why would Grass not be effective against Gengar? Is Dog Type... Is... Ghost Type is not resistant to Grass. 100% sure about, of that. But is there like a second typing that he... Has that resists it? Is Dog Type resistant to Grass? Need to know. Gengar. All right, Gengar. Let's find him up again. Uh, Gengar Gen Free Dex. Oh, he's Ghost Poison. I didn't know that. The more you learn. A shoal shell. She shell shoal shells on the shield shore. There's nothing there? Hmm, interesting. I think there might be a Pokemon in this place. In the rocks. No? Not even one? Fine, fine, fine. Oh, Lickitung. Uh, Lickitung is a normal type, so I can just fight. Bleh. For the longest time, I thought that Lickitung was a water type Pokemon. And to be, to be fair, it kind of makes sense. Also, it w uh, actually, no, it would make more sense if it was a dark type Pokemon. Because Lick, as an attack, is dark type. Or was it Ghost? I don't remember. I think it's dark. Ghost? Dark? Dark? Ghost? Hmm. A tacky moon. Okay, my Pokemons are in tip-top shape. Man, Break Break is destroying this entire place here. And if it's not break break, it's going to be bounce. The Kazakh has a really great move right now. And if it's not if it's not Vine Web either, it's going to be guillotine. Guillotine destroys everything that is not ghosts. So yeah. Have you made your Pokemon evolve very much? I mean... One of them? Just a single one of them has evolved? We don't mean... We don't need much evolution for the rest. Hmm... It's a swelling. I'm going to fly. Haha, <laughs> you can't attract me while I'm in the air. Well, I'm going I, well, I'm going to be still attracted to you, but in another sense. Yeah, Kadrian is getting plus two on every single stat, if not more. I want to know his stats now. His exact stats. Summary. Let's see. 
Yeah. I want to compare it to Dugong, to Joa's Dugong. Like level 29 compared to level 23. It's actually not that far behind. A little bit on the special attack and HP. Namely HP. HP is the, the biggest problem for for Cade. But it already has caught up with speed, defense, and attack. Special defense and special attack are still a little bit lacking, but the rest is pretty much caught up to, to Joe. At, with six levels behind. You're the Since it doesn't echo here. I mean... Yo de la There we go, that works, right? Uh, whoops. I might want to switch across the lake for this one battle. Bullet seed, and you missed. Yeah, on Monday, on Monday, I might, I might do a little bit of Mario 64 for the, um... Like, in a Mario 64 run hack, I don't know which one yet. Wow, it's faster than me. Interesting. Defeated a yodeling morpha. <laughs> That's kind of <laughs> that is <laughs> that is kind of funny in retrospect. <laughs> uh, let's switch Pokemon because Ooh. Cosmic is lacking a little bit of PP right now. Meteor Falls. Shoal Salt. We got some Shoal Shells before. Now the Shoal Salt. And now the Team Aqua defeats the Team Magma. And then the Team Aqua just goes away. And then this dude is like, oh, I'm a professor. But then the, the Team Magma is going into the chimney. <laughs> you're lucky. You're lucky my neighbors were bad and I get to get to watch you get to watch someone's my stream, yeah. Love love what I did with Luf. I I, I kinda like the idea as well of Luf just being like here and then I could just do this. Please don't kill don't one shot Latios. I would kinda like to, to have Latios here. Oh that is perfect. That is perfect. Also, hey there, Kate. How are you doing? Kachonk! We got him! We got him! Uh, let's see. Let's call him Diamond Blade because the, the late. The. <laughs> The first Diamond Blade had a very big problem. A, a Shadow Ball problem. First roll the Grey Ball, this is really cool. Yeah, right? And by the way, Kate. You have been named after an Articuno. We caught one as well earlier.
You haven't started the rigging yet? Oh. I kind of, I kind of wish, I kind of wish I had a better um, hold on coloring and shading. Because my biggest problem right now in trying to make a 3D model for a VTubing at all is actually the clothes. The clothes is a big problem I'm having. I think it's pretty strong, yeah. I think typing is his biggest drawback. At the same time, uh, all of the mons here have random moves. Oh, wait. Fire type? Ice is not effective for, for fire. Okay. Let's just cut then. But yeah, uh, Pokemons have random moves anyway, so... At the same time, it's not too bad to have problems with those. Uh, was there like a... I don't remember there being one place where I could just jump to a place I need. Mighty enough. Especially from Gen 4 onwards, where Stealth Rock will instantly mean half of its health vanishes upon switching in. Fortunately, this isn't Gen 4, Gen 4, this is Gen 3. Yeah, Zapdos is the best of, of the three. Like, no... No question. Mm, cuts might be better. Let's do this. Oh, po poison points. Dang it! What is the, with all the Pokemon having poison points? I mean, let's see. Let's let's see the. Uh... Yeah, its, it's speed is not that great. Like, especially compared to, to... To Cosmic here. Like, 84 speed altogether. But otherwise, the, the other stats are very decent. Uh, berries, please. I want a... Pitcher. A pitcher berry. Pitcher, pitcher, pitcher berry. There is nothing I can do here. Just, to, just go to, to this place. Uh, it's route 15. What is this all about? Box smash. Electric fire and steel. Steel is not too common. I, I haven't I haven't encountered like that many steel move uh, in in Durando yet. I kind of want to to to, to, uh, to drop down. Yeah, I'm dropping down. I need to regen badly. I kind of like the stats, the stats on Articuno, but yeah, there, there, are, there are some some there Pokemon out there for sure. Mm. But then again, I'm not I'm not playing Pokemon Cup like competitive Pokemon right now. I'm playing like very very casual Pokemon. I'm not going to have to have like and 
here's here's something you need to know though. The Pokemon can have random uh, TMs assigned to them, and they can almost they'll, they can also all learn HMs. And on top of this, um, accuracies are random. So a move can have like a hundred percent accuracy. Or it can have like 20% or even 0% accuracy. I've seen a move with zero accuracy. So yeah, moves are not exactly the the same as you would know normally. So uh, competitive Pokemon might not necessarily affect the, uh, the thing here. I should have used Rubel. Yeah, yeah, but that's what I mean. You would need an extra move in order to do so. So normal moves that would normally hit Articuno, for example, would not necessarily. Oh, there you go. There are the repels. I am not lucky. I, Kate, Kate, you have no idea how many Pokemons I have lost due to sheer unluckiness. You have no idea. Wait, what is this? Oh, is this strength? Yes, this is strength. Perfect. You have no idea. Clearly my bad yeah yeah all bad luck overflows and just and just brings it back to the, to the max. Yeah just goes from minus twenty-five to a two hundred and fifty-five to uh, to just one. That's not that's not exactly how it's, it's good. this would work normally. <laughs> but yeah, um yeah, I'll just keep Crystal Lee. Yeah, have a, have have a wonderful time, Claire. And see you later on. I might stop pretty 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 soon. I think I'm going to be doing the the team magma thing in the the Mount chimney, and then just just call it for the day. I don't know. Never allowed to stop. But why though? I want I want to do some uh, some more editing today. I've I've worked a little bit. Oh, the ripple will are off. Eh, that's fine. I want to do a little bit more video editing today and have some fun doing so. Miracle seed. Not great. But I'll take it. I think the glasses were. Here, but that's not the glasses, that's some fab mail. I can't find my glasses, maybe they're not around here. Yeah, I'm so sorry, Matt. <laughs> I didn't find your glasses over here. don't have your one move that is absolutely horrible to deal with, right? What is what is effective against Shedinja? Of course it has one the gods. Um What is effective against Shedinja? So it's a bug ghost type. 
so I should be able to deal with it with a flight type, right? Hey. Because flying type deals critical damage to to bugs. Yeah, there we go. Get out of here. <gasps> Don't want to be dealing with any more challenges. <laughs> Let me get away. Alright, so this is Verdant Turf. Wait, this is like still way far away from where I would need to be. Um, where's my bicycle? I think I might be tempted to say to get the, uh, the 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 faster bike instead. I've seen like quite a few paths where I needed my faster bike. The Mac bike. Okay, can I use it straight away? Yes, perfect. Wait, this isn't the place where I need to be. It's harder to control as well. I like how we how the sprite just switches to to not on bicycle and then just goes back into into the bicycle just afterwards. I find it silly. Ah, there it is. The cable car is ready to go up. The bicycle was an illusion all along. Yeah, it's a, It's like... It's like the horse. It's just two coconuts. But it's a horse, right? Before! Alright, so I need to find the one... Ah, there it is. The coconuts are clearly unrelated. Yep. We don't even know how they got there to begin with. We just got them. They were just there. We're cur they, they were cal cu carried by swallows. Which kind of swallow? I do not know. Could be an Euro a, a European swallow, though. It's a qu it's a question of weight ratios. I do know that. Just cut. Cut. Cut to cut to cut to cut to. Maybe if it tries hard enough, you know. There we are not taking the willpower into a, into into the into numbers here. Maybe if the willpower is good enough, it'll be able to. Maybe two, one on either side. That would be kind of silly, but... But with a net. A net? Technically, technically two is possible. One on either, uh, on either side carrying a net. That would definitely b be possible.
Let's say a small, tiny, 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 small plug for, for the Discord. <laughs> you already that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you just you're told. It's a, it's a small size, a small tiny plug to, to, to Discord. <laughs> A puzzle. I've all the, I've I've, uh, I've to been told a lot that my that Fluffier is either like a uh... oh I, I I forgot something about about Fluffy in the uh, the Gibby mode and in the and the tiny cat emotes that the, the, not the emotes but the the, the obvious thing. I forgot the, the two cheeks thing. I have like two two little things off to the side each time. The color is is like the opposite of the oh low kick really now. The opposite of the color on the ear. I need to fix this. Give him a still still looks a stick. <laughs> Thanks. I really needed to 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 change it. been better if I had Cosmic lead the fight, but I can deal with. Take a few cuts. Oh, crunch. A bit late. But, it's fine. I think it's, it, there's something kind of funny with, like, a, an evil bad guy just throwing away a Pokemon as cute as a Togepi at, at, at your face as the first Pokemon. <laughs> There's something, there's something <laughs> kind of, kind of funny about that whole scene. Okay, that's more, that's more of an evil Pokemon. Or an evil guy Pokemon, rather. Ow. Uh, might resist that one. Wow, that dealt no damage. And that dealt a lot of damage. Cosmic is still alive, though. That would be very risky to do to do it like that. Um, let's use Joe instead. I'm going to try and use. Hydro Pump. Oh wow, that was a crit. Yeah, that does a lot of damage. Perfect. Kadrian grew to level 26. With some very decent stats. Latios. I don't have anything with Joe that could deal with a Latios very easily. So let's switch back to Crystal Lee and see what we can do. I think Blizzard might be might be good. We'll see. Yeah, there you go. Easy. We shall meet again! No, never. I am removing the meteorite. 
I'm not losing any more Pokemons again to poison. I did it once, never again. Like I, I... So in one of my runs, I caught a Pokemon by poisoning him, poisoning him and then throwing all of the balls I had. I managed to catch him. It has one HP with poison. I went three steps away and killed a Pokemon. It kind of hurts. What's the matter, Cookie? I am going to empty your... I know, right? I felt so bad. I felt so bad. And it was a good Pokemon as well. Had a decent moveset. I struggled so much to catch it. And then I did, I did three steps and lost it all. I felt so bad after that. Never did it again. But I really needed the, the poison in order to catch to catch it because otherwise there was no way I would catch it with a no normal Pokeball. Don't mind me, just getting lava cookies. good in Lara Cookies now. Right? Yeah. That seems good. However, my health is not perfect. I wish you could just buy them normally instead of having to mash. But like, hey, we sell... We sell... Those cookies for 200. How many do you want? I want... I want 99 of them. Please, give all 99 of them to me. Yeah. I'll buy your entire cookie stock right here, right now. I don't even care. Just give those to me. What to purchase a major stake in? Yeah, yeah, give me the stonks. Um, I'll grow, I'll grow your cookie shop into an empire. Bonk. I must dig. Oh, 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 and of course, this would be the perfect place to have the bike that would let you just, I don't know, biggity bounce? Because I can't do that anymore. It's okay. Hmm, interesting. Um... I think blizzards might hurt. Nope, never mind. He didn't he even freeze. And that one hurt though. Uh, dig then? Wait, it's a flight type. Is it? No, it's a bug steel type, right? Oh! Oh no! Oh no! I'm dead. 
Oh, no, I'm good. Whew. It has the perfect counter to dig. Ugh. Oh, let's have Ju deal with it instead. I think Poison Tail should be... Ugh. Good enough. do in the meanwhile. I'll use one potion to heal Crystal Lily. Oh no. He bounced. Okay, can I attack you now? It doesn't affect it because it's deal type. Ah! Uh, rock Slash? Okay, that didn't deal any damage whatsoever. Don't crit. Whew. Slugma? I think I could just deal with it, like destroy it. I drop bomb. Was a bit risky if it had a, a move that would move faster than me, but yeah, nah, destroyed it. No, no, I want, I, I kind of want to 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 go wherever you are right now. You know that there, there, there's that rock like that you're staring at right now. I kind of want, I want to move you over and just go through it, please. I just destroyed you in a battle. No. All right. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of like to 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 make sure that my Pokémon are not going to die on the next battles. Picnic a Bob sent a Persian to Basil. Hello, traveler. I want your strongest, your strongest Persians. Um, I'll take Cosmic. The stinking Waylord that managed to destroy Diamond Blade with just a single Shadow Ball. Still remembering it. And that thing has a move that deals like 40 HP worth of damage at, the, at least. Like this thing packs some major punch. Like it's almost two shots one of my one of my level twenty-five or something. While it was level twelve or level thirteen. It was bonkers. I might switch to to cosmic right now. Um let's do this. Alright. Kate is officially stronger than Joe right now. While still having two levels worth of... ...of deficit. What weird reality is this? <laughs> it does have... 
you do have hair cutter as well. That's not bad. Like, you have some really good moves, save for rage. I don't think I have any HMs I could teach you. Ooh, Strength has some decent attack for. I'm tempted to teach you Strength so that I can have like a, a one move. But the, uh, the accuracy is not that great. I'll wait a little bit more. If I find a hard scale, that, that might make it even better because of the move tutor. Alright. Unfortunately, I switched to Cosmic. This one, this one is a little bit hard to deal with. Of lights. You can confirm your rage isn't very effective at getting anything done. Rage is never, never a way, never an option. <gasps> oh no, I'm sorry, Joe. We encountered an Eevee, but we can't catch it. I'm sorry, Joe. I'm so sorry, Joe. I haven't encountered any... any Pokemons yet. And by the way, we do have a clause for... for this. If we encounter an Eevee, no matter if I have encountered a... No matter if I have encountered a monster and dealt with it as well, we are going to catch it. Eevee butts. <laughs> ah, yes. I'll capture it. It's very low HP. We haven't encountered any Pokemon yet in this road, so. Mommy. It's a free mon. Alright. Uh... Let's go over Liquid for this one. Since, yeah. Yeah, I was the last one that was talking. Here we go. You'll be sitting in the box for a while. I'm very sorry. But at least you're in here. Jack's Pass is a hard to work on. I'm getting a lot of water or ice type Pokemons. I'm still lacking a, a good fire type. I don't even have a single fire type move. Oh, I missed my break break. Dang it. Don't harden. I'll just kill. Ah, uh, I missed. No, I missed. Ouch. Is this only twice? Is Bone Meringue like only only twice? Been a day with a headache and sad day. Ah, uh, hopefully, hopefully that's that will subside. I've had my moments where my my headache was like very very strong, and I think that most of it was caused of my because of my headset and uh, the heat getting to me as well. Uh, having a fan right next to my bed helped a lot with it.
because we don't have any ACs here. Air conditioning is not something we have in Europe. And I really wish we had. But then, I, then again, I I re understand I re understand that why why we don't have air conditioning in normal homes. It's because well we won't be we wouldn't be able to like this would lead this would leave a f big good old problem. Um, ecology wise. If that's the term for it, but yeah, this is this is going to leave a, a bad imprint onto onto the uh, the earth if we all had some some ACs here. Okay, so roots and and things like that are great, but they they leave. Wait. Oh, powder snow! Let's see. Yeah, yeah. I do love the so so here's the thing. I do love the country. I love France as a whole. But I don't like the French. It's it's different. <laughs> I like the country. I don't like the French. is a, a real nice place to be in overall which is why uh when when i'm when people ask me like if you don't like the french why don't you move away it's because like i'm like france is a great place to be in I, it's 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 like the air is breathable there is plenty of convenience while still like having way less problems than most countries even first world first world uh, countries like like the USA or uh, I don't know uh, Italy, Greece, or, or like these these kinds of countries where where there's like there's like some good things about them, but there's also like a bit some bigger problems behind them. So I'm I'm really okay with being in France. It's just that I don't like the French at all. <laughs> Well, most French. There, there, there are some, some real, real sweethearts in, in France, but it's really hard to find those. So, is my area hot and humid or hot and dry? Usually, it's not hot at all. Uh, usually, it's it's like damp and uh, kind of chilly. But sometimes it can get like real hot and uh, hot and humid. I have... I can get an egg. Let's get the egg. Yeah, it's real hard to, do, to deal with. Yeah, here it's 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 impossible to deal with. Actually, I don't mind it being hot. Like I really like hot temperatures and whatnot. But it's just that there was something else on top of that that got me. I think I think it was just due to the stress and and just being having having something on top of my head at all times that made it even harder for me to to deal with overall. I'll get a, a couple of super repulse. 
kind of would like some some more soda pops. Soda pops are are very decent for that price. All right, I do not remember anything about those. Ah, life potion, how much do I miss you? Life potion got completely destroyed. Because of a uh, of a scary a scary stare and a a bone meringue combo, hit it four times altogether, just murder them. But yeah, I I like hot temperatures. Like I'm much more resilient to hot temperatures than I am for cold temperatures. It's just that, yeah, there there was something in the air that just made this that made me feel very sick. And the worst part is that there was also like I couldn't even open my windows because right outside of my home they made like some construction things and whatnot, and they spread something in the air that was like outright nasty. It smelled like gasoline for a whole month straight. So we had to keep... Oh, no. That might be a double. Yeah, that's a double battle. But yeah, there, there was something in the air that smelled like gasoline for a month straight. So I really couldn't deal with it. Good day sounds good, yeah. That, that, that was for a whole month. I had to deal to deal with that on top of my on top of my my headache. Trying to join Team Precision in my maker. So practicing a level right now. Oh nice! not too keen on joining uh, the Team Precision as a whole. Like, I love the, te the, the Team Precision levels, don't get me wrong. But at the same time, I'm not, like, too willing to join a team as a whole. I just I just want to have fun with the levels and, and call it a day at the end of the day. This is why I love, like, the, um, the Curated Trolls team, because you don't have to join the team to enjoy the levels at all. Then again, you don't need to join the team at the Team Precision or the Team Shell or the Team Jump or all of the other teams either. But it's just that the, there's a, something about the point system that I'm not too keen on. You made a promise, and now you have to. <laughs> hey, at least you're ignoring that promise. At least you're ignoring that promise, and that's that is sweet of you. Join, you need to get a certain amount of points and beat a three or a three and a four. So how, like, how hard would a four be, for example?
Like a couple of, tra of tram jumps here and there. A, uh... Oh no, that was bad. That was a bad idea. Whoops. That is also a bad idea. That was even worse of an idea. So, right there. Then this would lead me straight next to this. And I just drop down here. And I messed up. <laughs> oh no, that should be good. Wait, no, that leads me back to the beginning. No! I goofed. I have no idea how to describe the difficulty. Ah, oh, that's their sign. Their sign. It is precise. <laughs> that's all we need to know. <laughs> Alright, fine. We'll get rid of that Bulbasaur. Unless... Unless it just digs or anything. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> ah, I didn't choose the right spot. Okay, so right here. No, not this one. Then I need to take this here. Uh, wait. I need to take the right one. Whee! Okay. Let's make sure that everything is in order before we fight this. Okay, we should be good. A Flannery, let's go. I should be able to just begin bounce. Oh, there is... That is some, something I didn't know. Oh, managed to survive. That is something I didn't know even was a thing. You can regain HP while in flight. Oh, come on. <laughs> if that's how you want it to go. Break Break might be able to, to deal a lot of damage to this. Not that much, actually. It's not too bad. Like, this fight is really not too bad. Cosmic is going to make... some delicious chicken out of it. Yeah, finding leftovers was a boon. <laughs> okay. Matt Choke. Okay, Shadow Punch isn't going to deal too much damage to us, and leftovers is going to alleviate a little bit of that damage. What? What? Where's that move? Can can you? Excuse me. Could you please not? I would I would I would rather if you did not, sir. Uh... 
especially with this, dang it. Since you have fire punch, punch, use fire punch. Okay, I am flying. I am bouncing. I am Biggie bouncing. Oh, wait, there was no pets. Why is there no pets? No, oh, there is no pets. Oh, that is interesting. Oh no, there is, there, there is pets. That, that would be pets. There, 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 there's a problem with the pets. There's a problem with the doggo. There's a pro- there'll be a problem with the doggo. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that, there'll be a problem with doggo. Give me a moment. Uh... Steel modes. Let's see. The other ones. You should be on the opposite here. Boink, 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 boink. All right, one more pet just for, for good times. Okay, but what about staying the pets? Okay. There we go, and now we're going to pet again. <laughs> okay, that's not what I expected to get. <laughs> I think I might have broken the pet. <laughs> Whoops. Just one more, just to make sure. Alright, what if I spare the pet again? Just just to make sure. Are we good? We are good. Okay, now it works. Perfect. Whew. Is that dog from Undertale? Uh, yeah, it's it's supposed to be the, uh, the dog from Undertale, but I replaced the sword with the baguettes instead. And Bigly Panton. And it's yelled again with Moonlight. What is this? Stop it with that move. You can also replace the doggo with an EV instead. That was a great thing, it. Finally! Gee, bus! Yeah, that was scary. Mini tight. All right. Uh, Express sensor should be very effective against those. Oh, somewhat. Yo, why do you lose an eye proportion on the mid tight of all things? Come on. Okay, this is becoming a strong melodic. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry about that. It came out of nowhere. Wow, it's kind of strong. Thank you. By the way, normally the lock and unlock command should work. <laughs> Titterless. What? No. 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 What? Okay. Everything broke today. Everything broke today. Everything is breaking today. Gets. <laughs> <laughs> 
I need to see. I need to see what happens on the. Uh... All right, media. Stream, chat bots. Ah, uh, commands. Look. Look, bots. Yeah, 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 I think you can redo one more lurk, Kate. Uh, you can do uh, you can do a uh, exclamation lurk again. This would work normally. I think it was a problem because of my hard drive disk. And then you can do an lurk as well. Ugh. I'm not letting Kate dry. No way, Jose. You... <laughs> it helps when you open them first. So, here's the thing. Uh, the, ran the, the window is going to be completely random. It's, it's, it might be open, it might be closed. It depends. And then when you unlock, it's also going to to, to react depending on the uh, the message. Hello there, you. I do not want to fight you yet. Thank you for the go googles. It's it's it was a little bit weird the first uh, the first one because my my hard drive disk didn't catch up with the command and so was slow enough for the bot to read the the text mid sentence so it's not even a a software problem it's a hardware problem. Mention to my mod commissions I should offer about Bulwark stuff. It's actually in the plans. I have a... I have an idea as to what I could be uh, proposing for other people. Um, especially on Leon Board. Leon Board is uh, the one thing I can, I can help people with. But the main problem is how much should I charge for that, that thing? Because... Uh, Sometimes it could take me like 50 seconds to, to just pull out a, a comment out, out of the ether. And sometimes it's going to take me three, three weeks or like a month. Like it's, it's really hard to, to decide on prices for that kind of stuff. But it's definitely, it's definitely something I really want to be able to do is... Uh, Opening commissions for Leoran Bolt. Leoran Bolt is something I really like to, to fiddle around with, and it's really easy to program things on. Like everything, like the um, the stream stalling thing, uh, stream stalling screen. I can, I can, I think I can show it to you right now. Let's see. Uh, scene. Ba -ba -ba -bam. I'm going to be pausing this for now. Boop. So the stream starting screen here. So map. So everything in there. So then I'm going to be initializing this. So this thing here, every single thing, every single uh, stuff that is going to be in there is completely... Uh, let's see. Let's... Bap. There we go. So every, every single thing that's moving on screen right there is moved by Lirenbolt. 
So you can clearly make some some very nice animations and some some funny some funny things with it, uh, just by using OBS and Leo and Bolt. So I can make like graphic commissions to to make some animations on screen for transitions for uh, animations on screen for comments for uh, channel port redemptions. So there's like a, a ton of things I could I could be doing with Leo and Bolt. So depending on how much work I need to pull on into into it, uh, like it could it could be as simple as just paying me like ten bucks and going as far as like five hundred. It's it's really that weird of a price. But yeah. So. Whoop. I'm going to start it off here. And Papa. But yeah, it's gonna be it can be like a, a lot of work just for a just for a single command, just for or or a couple of commands. Like making the, the luck and unluck work needed me to, to work around two bots two different bots and different um, ways to interact with those. Yeah, that's that's the thing. But I'm also scared of the people being like, what? $300 just for a simple command? And I'm like, well, uh, you you got to, you got to take into account that I need to make like a full graphic, a full graphic of 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 the thing. I need to make the full uh, algorithm of the entire, the entire program. I need to debug the pro the program, and I I need to, <laughs> I need to create to create the program in such a way that it's not going to be abusable by by normal viewers. Uh, it's going to have like like there's so many things into into making a. Uh, a program with layer and boards that's that's user dependent and yeah I I really I'm I'm really scared uh, of of those problems right now which is why I want to focus first into making some emotes uh, before anything else making some emotes before anything else then branching out into other other harder commissions later on once I manage to get a better grasp on what I need to do. Okay. Oh, dang it. I just wanted to see what was up there. Can bounce. I find it kind of funny that bounce is going to be super effective against Victory Bell because Victory Bell just has just has to open the leaf, wait for the Pokemon to just bounce inside it, and then just close the leaf back on. <laughs> it's literally as simple as that. Okay, so this is just a shortcut. Okay, I need a hard work. I bring idea, bring me the success. I do. I don't think I deserve any success. Uh, like the hard work, the hard work I put in is for people to be happy with. If I can make as as many people as happy as possible, that in turn will bring me happiness as well. And if, in turn, that happiness can... Like, if the result of that happiness is, like, success, I'm like, okay, fine. But the true, go the true end goal is to make as many, as many people as happy as possible.
Humility is good for me from your end. Sure, but that's not so fast and you get to say this. What exactly? What are you going to say? What is the thing? <laughs> on the opposite the, the opposite way being able to make somebody happy will give you more of a chance to find other people and make them happy in this way as well not if, uh, if that makes sense but being able to being able to offer people something to being, being able to find something to help people with is going to help more people and help you have a bigger reach because you manage like for example let's say let's say you you help like a uh, you help somebody out with their their moving and they're, they're like oh yeah that the dude the dude is it's really good at at like at, at helping helping move and they will talk about you, about how you help them move into other places, and some and and, and somebody else is like, "Hey, can you can help me move? I'll 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 help you. I'll I'll, I'll help you out. I'll just I'll just toss you a dinner and 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 a little bit of of money as well." Like, I think I think that doing making making yourself like bringing your bringing more worth to yourself, like learning more skills and. Refining those skills and then bring them, bringing them to other people to make them happy, to help them with their problems, is more helpful than seeking success in the long run. And this is what this is why I've been like working hard because I try to become a better person as a whole because I know that I'm. I've been, I've, I've had like a lot of problems in my life and a lot of issues I really wish to, 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 to fix. Both on myself, on my stream, on my brand, like on, on pretty much a lot of, of different ways. But at the same time, also I killed, I killed, I killed the Pokemon here. Uh, the, this is supposed to be a Nuzlocke. Whoops. Um, but yeah, finding finding a way to refine yourself and then finding a way to bring the skills you acquired by doing so to other people is the better way to go on about life. Because even if you don't find success in doing so, the skills you have acquired will pile on and on and on until you find something that actually makes you successful. Because even in those failures, you will have learned something. You will have become a better person in, in, in the long run. Yeah, ouch. I'm going to bounce. I'm not taking a dig, some dig damage again. A failure isn't a failure if, learn, if you've learned from it and grown, yeah. Well, actually, no. I would say I would say that a failure can still be a failure even if you learn from it, depending on the gravity of the failure. But it is always possible to recover from a failure if you know what you're doing. I... 
<laughs> I don't know where to go. Where does I want to go again? So I've done the, the Mount Chimney thing. I've recovered the meteorites. I'm on to Mobile City, but I don't know how to surf yet. So I can't go the, uh, the right way. I could technically go back to Stateport City or to, um, to Petalburg. I think I need to go back to Petalburg to get the last badge there. So what I want to go is for Mobile. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Burr, 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 burr. Uh, Mobile, Slayport, go back to Dewford and then pedal back through, through this. Unless I could go through Rustboro in some way, shape or form to get the, the badge from there. I hmm. think though the best way would be to go, to go down. That would be the fastest way with a bicycle anyway. Yeah, failing it failing has been has been pretty much a a part of my of my entire life. And that's not that's not meant as self-depreciation or, or anything. Like I made I've made a lot a lot of failures and a lot of uh, I've had a lot of problems overall in my entire life. But at the same time it bonk. At the same time, I've learned a lot from those, and I have tried a lot of things in... After after a certain while, after dealing with, with those same problems... I have learned a lot. Uh, I, have, I have taught myself a lot of things, I have tried a lot of things, I've failed at most. And... Still kept on going because if you don't go keep going in life, what are you going to do? Ooh, Santa. Ah, uh, nah, that's bad. 25 attack uh, accuracy. Oof. Yeah, bonk. Bonk, bonk, bonk. I think this is going to be weak to... No, break, break. This is a fight type, I think. Yeah. Not weak to it, but... Nah. Oh, come on. I would love one. I would love a Celebi. Flying would be great. Biggity bounce. It's yeah, still good. Ariana, that's another fight type. Here's a little bit of your own medicine. I think it's... Yeah, I'm not used to bike racing at all. I I usually don't like to have the Mac one. I go for the Acro bike instead. You're weak. What is this? Okay, Atropius at level 6. What is this? And managed to survive one hand. Maybe it has Endure, like the, um, the uh, Endure ability.
The cosmic with leftovers. That's all. That's all I need. Lantern will be destroyed with Vino as well. That's kind of impressive that it's, that, that was only level six with with some level fourteen. I think that would, might might have been a bug. Because those are not supposed to be at that level, at least. My word, your cycling skills bolder and terrifying. Most suddenly you need much more practice riding. <laughs> no, shut up. <laughs> my, my, my bike riding skills are perfectly fine. <laughs> Absolutely okay. Uh, the soda pop. Oh, yeah, right. Let's get some more soda pop. It's 300 a bottle, which is less than half of the price of a super potion and heals more than a super potion. So we are definitely getting some of those. Same time, let's have a, a small hydration break. Oh. Well, yeah, it's nice to be able to just chill and and have a nice little drink in front of the time. How many solar pops do I have right now? My guess is not enough, but I'll take one more and then we'll see how much. Eh, 31, that's decent. I really wish they did let us buy more than just one at a time though. <laughs> Please, I want to go to Dufort. I like that you can see the ghost ship from here. And pedal bag. Let's go. One more gym battle to go. And hopefully we, go we don't get smashed for this one. All of our Pokémon should be in decent shape. Uh, Crystal Lee doesn't have any items attached to her yet. Um, I do not have... Personally, has dig, so given soft sand would be kind of a good idea, as it's one of its major major attacks. But before I do that, I'm going to check if I have like in a nice type item in my PC. Unfortunately not. So, I'm going to give it the go. The soft sand. So, give to Crystal Lily. Oop. 
So we should be good to go. Uh, isn't there an item you can get from going back to... To Jimmy's, Willy's, Wally's... Home? No, apparently not. I thought there was something, but apparently not. But, I will be doing this gym though. The speed type. Yeah, because... Because I'm definitely going to have speed type Pokemons in there. Right? Right? Definitely a speed type, this one, right? Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hey. Oh, no. I'm weak. Oh, no. Um... Break, break? Ooh, don't crit. Don't crit. Okay. So instead... <laughs> uh, I'm in kind of a big problem. I'm big trouble. I'm weak. Let's go with Cadrian. Oh no, signal beam against Cadrian, which is ice type. Whatever shall I do? Is that cutter going to work? Yes, perfect. Meteor mash. That's an interesting move. <laughs> I am not letting you die. Are you kidding me? I'm not letting you die. I'm not letting you die at all. That was not a speed type. I was lied to. Also, thank lord. <laughs> thank lord I bought all of these solar pops. Because I'm going to be using those. Okay, so... Defense room. Confusion room. It's a perfect room to go in! Because it's not going to have the confusion room. <laughs> it's the best place to go in, right? Oh no, this might have confusion. Uh... It should bounce. Oh, skill swap. That's not that's not a bad move I could have dealt with. Dealt with. Just going to die anyway. Mind whip. Unless hyper potion. But I can still bounce. It's okay. A critical head as well. Would have been great if I if I actually had that at first, but mm, that's fine. All right, strength through Medias. Oh, a Jolteon. I don't have that much I could deal against a Jolteon, but big break, I guess. Firepower was weakened! <laughs> I don't have. I'm just going to say, I think I have like more than. more than eight hours. Let's see. I want to see a save. 
It's seven hours in. I still haven't encountered a single fire moves move inside my entire moveset. Not even a single one. Didn't take any damage in that round. <laughs> All right, leader Yosh. Apparently, Yosh is my dad. Where's all the fire? All right, I have yet to encounter a single one. Oof. That didn't deal any damage at all to, to them. But at the same time, they don't deal any damage to me, so it's kind of worth. I might switch to a better Mon afterwards. Either switch to Cade or Joe. No, Joe is actually kind of weak. Uh, maybe Crystal Lily. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> of course. You know what? I'm switching to Crystal Lily right now. It's going to deal even less damage to them, and at the same time. They are going to hurt themselves with Dark Skin. Nice. Spoink. Isn't that a ghost? No, no, this is a Psy type, I think. Lucky Joe's away in AFK, <laughs> calling me weak like that. I mean, Joe, Joe was taken because I didn't have any EVs yet. The next EV I, ca I catch is definitely going to be Joe anyway, so... Um, a spoink. Spoink. Let's have Cajun. Speaking of way, try, time to try the system one more time. Yeah, go ahead. You can even do unlurks while still not lurking yet, and it's still it's, it's still going to do something else instead. Hmm, that dealt some decent damage. Oh, but that also dealt some decent damage. So if you're not if you're not lurking, you can do unlurk. Um, you can do unlock when, you, when you're not... You're, you haven't used the command, it's, it's still going to use another random command on top of that. Nice. Oh, oh, no. No, no data has found, has found the, uh... No data has found, has found the problem. Oh, no. I'm going to have to fix it. Dang it! It shouldn't, it shouldn't react to the data. Yeah. Is it coincidence? Hey, I don't know. And also, hey, the data. So when you when you're not using the lurk command, it's it's unlurking. It's it's doing a special a special unlurk command. But when you're lurking, it's it detects what kind of of commands you should have in the stack. But apparently the stack is not working properly, so I need to 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 find a way to fix it. The problem is that I meant I need to have multiple commands, multiple accounts for this, which makes it a lot harder to do.
You never luck, so maybe you rock it. Me maybe. Maybe not. Um I think the problem was that it didn't detect the name. No data. And still gave you Cadrin's um unlock command. But it, it's something. It's something I need. I kind of need to to find. Like I need. To, I need to to find a way to give uh, a way for the stack to recognize the names. If that's truly the problem. Perhaps it was your first. I don't think that's that's the, the real problem. I don't think that's the real problem there. I think it's more because the bot in itself didn't detect the name in itself. It could have been like any any other people. We can test out the cooldown. And the the cooldown should should be should be down right now. It's it should be good. There shouldn't be any cooldowns right now. So let me see. Let me grab my. Okay, so is the, st is the stack created? No, the stack has not been created. So there's a problem with that. Why is the stack not created? Oh, maybe? No. No, the stack has been created. Okay, so the, the, the stack is there. So I'm going to try it myself. Yeah, but it didn't add to the stack. And I'm watching this. And look. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so it's erased the other one. Yeah, it's it's it doesn't detect the stack properly. I need to, I'll need to redo the um, the entire. I need to to redo the entire thing. Yeah. See, this is this is this is why I need I need I need to to debug it out. I'm alright. I'm in I'm in Nisekai worlds. I'm I'm all fine. I mean, I'm I can use magic. I can I have like a broken power and and I have all the fame now. Yay. A stack does that mean you can luck twice? Uh, this is not exactly how what it means. Is that the way I try to stock the usernames uh, of the different of the different uh, people here? I'm trying to make, basically make a table, like a uh, not a table, a a list. A list of people that are using the luck command and assigning a value to those um, to those usernames. So, for example, uh, for Kadrin, this would have been luck. Uh, uh, this would have been six because this is Ellen six, the sixth um, message in question, and. So the luck is predefined by the the unlock is predefined by the luck. Yes. So I want to have like the commands by the luck, uh, creating a different reaction with the unlock. And for this, I'm trying to stock different usernames and stock that value so that I can make different reactions to the unlock command and unfortunately the stack didn't work well and I need to find a way to make it better. So for that I will make I will have to make a <laughs> to remake the entire program. <laughs> Maybe I could I could I could do a short uh, a short programming session. Like either on Discord or on or on Monday before before I do some Mario 64. 
like to show to show the uh, the, the reasoning I have behind the the, the Leo and bot commands and what I usually do to to make it this way. All right, this is flatter. Flatter is not good. Dang it. By the way, there's a funny thing about about this entire uh, gym here. When you get into the room, the other door is closed, sure, but the the mat is not there. That I, I really don't understand why it's like this. But the mat is not there. Oh, I have stuff now. Alright. So that was five badges. Actually, I can show you a little bit how the, um... Let's see. Let me launch... Krita for a moment. Because I think I have, like, the, uh, the idea still on the, on the Krita file. Let's see. Hey, Dalina, how are you doing? Uh, Lurk? No. What was it? St uh, stupid ideas, maybe? I don't remember. I don't remember where I placed it. Uh, chatbot commands, Lurk... No. Send to challenges? Neither. It's really... Everyone is showing up the later I go. Clearly, clearly needed to be a 24-hour stream. Good lord, I wouldn't be able to hold up at all. How am I doing? I'm doing pretty well, having a lot of fun uh, with the randomizer, the Pokemon Emerald randomizer. It has it has been like a roller coaster of emotions. We've lost many, many Pokemons. Uh, maybe this one? No, it's not this one. Yeah, I don't. Fi I can't. I can't find it anymore. Need it. Because I had like something for... This is the shared logs. This is for Twitter banner. Ugh. I have so many folders now. Like, believe it or not, I've made like a stream... Uh, a stream folder just, just for all assets I need for my streams and whatnot. And for, for the different ideas I have, the different drawings I do, and all kinds all kinds of random stuff I, I usually draw and, and have fun with. And I have over 10 gigs worth of drawings, assets, and other random stuff I have made over the, the two years. Like 12 gigs worth of, dra of drawings. Isn't that crazy? You missed the chillness of the stream. Ah, oh, I missed you as well, Alina. I never get to see you that much these days, so I'm, I was kind of a little bit, a little bit, a little bit sad. I'm glad to, I'm able to see you again. I saved like some just chattings. Oh, Lux. Ah, there you go. I found it. All right, let me switch to your heart and chill for a moment. Alright, so I've made like like a lot of different things overall to let's see. I think this is 
map supposed to be grouped all together with this one. Uh, let's see. This is the unlock. Okay. So, basically what I want you to do is the user does a an exclamation lurk. Then, I'm grabbing the username of the lurk. Which Namaki bot then re uh, like replies with a number and then the lock message. So then, I'm grabbing the wildcard, like the number in that in that message. Now I'm checking if the bot, uh, if the message comes from the bot. So that's so that's um, a moderators uh, are not going to to trigger that thing um, inadvertently. And then, if this is coming from the bot, insert the username that we caught up above into step 2 into the first stack. And then, it's going to grab the number and place it into the second stack, which we're going to be using into unlurk afterwards. So... Uh, ba -ba -ba -bam. There you go. So, when a user does unlock, it's supposed to be grabbing the username and then making, making sure that the username is in the first stack. If that username is in stack 1, uh, it's going to be grabbing the position in that stack. And it's going to grab the lock number that is in the position of the stack 2. Because the position of the two of the two things will be at the same position each time because whenever somebody enters the stack they're going to be all the way on the top so and whenever it grabs the both of these it's going to erase them and then give the number the number of the line in the log text and then afterwards it replaces the dot text in the log bot and then it's, it's going to be reading the line in in that text or this is what this that was that was supposed to work, but apparently there is a problem in that section right here. I don't know why this is beige, but yeah, this is, there is a problem in that section right here. So I need to make sure that searching the username is actually correctly done, and if it works well, well, the rest should work properly. But I don't know why this is not working as well as it would, as it should be, right now. <sighs> That's more work for me, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, the, there's there's like a lot of ways I would rather be doing this. Like, for example, have the uh, the streamer chatbot do everything instead of relying me on my own re re reply to to the thing. But it shouldn't be that hard to do. The main problem is requiring multiple Twitch accounts in order to debug this, and I can't use the bot in order to do this. Because the bot doesn't re re reply to its own answers. If this, if this, that makes sense. So, for example, if I go into the bot and I do explanation luck, it's not going to do anything. So it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't work. So yeah, this is this is the biggest problem right now with the. Uh, with this, is that I need multiple accounts to test this. I'm gonna be testing this out uh, tomorrow, I guess. Tomorrow, oh wait, wait tomorrow, tomorrow's Monday. So yeah, uh, so it's going to be either, either just before the stream, or I'm going to be doing it like on Discord or a another way. Hey there, Simo, how are you doing? So yeah, for now, it's semi-working. It's semi-working, It's it works somewhat, but not exactly how I wanted it to go. <laughs> At least the, the unlurk, uh, the no-lurk command works well. 
That's the, that's the only thing that works actually fine. Why have the last couple of streams had no webcam? So the main problem with my webcam right now is that my lighting is not perfect. If I if I go and and put my my green screen on and my lighting and, and whatnot, the green screen is going to be a mess. And the lighting I usually have around around the uh, the character I handingly here, uh, it's not. Like, it's just making dots all around on the screen, so it's not going to be worth at all. So this is this is why this is not going to be uh, to be good for me, unfortunately. But yeah, so... My main problem right now is that I... Somehow, this is not being grabbed. So I need to make sure that it is actually searching for the username in the stack one. And if that username is in the stack one, um, because it's going to be grabbing that name. If this is, if this name is in, it should grab the position of that name in that stack and the luck number in the second stack. But I... But so far, I don't know why it's not behaving like it should be. In my setup page, I say what quality and refresh rate my monitors have, but more what they are. So what are they? Uh, I think... Okay, so don't quote me on this, but I think... So there's one I'm 100% I'm sure it's a VG... 245 from Asus. Uh, by the way, my handwriting is horrible because I, I'm drawing on mouse right now. Um, actually, let me grab my <laughs> my drawing tablet for a moment because <laughs> I can I can I can draw on mouse. There you go. Uh, so my so my monitor on the left is a VG 245 uh, by Asus. Uh, um, my my uh, I, my money on the middle is a Nerus, but I don't remember its its name and my my. My monitor on the right side is a Samsung, and that's all I know. I don't remember a very exact, um, a very exact nomenclature. Uh, the Samsung I got it like on on the second hand for like a hundred euros, which was a pretty good price for it, a uh, hundred forty-four hertz. But the Eros, I don't remember the uh, the exact nomenclature. But it's a good one. It's it's my main. This one is my main screen. Like it's a, like that. That one is a 240 hertz display, and it's so great when I do when I do play some FPS or some fast paced some fast paced things. Today is your birthday for another few hours, and you got lots of cool thing thingies. Well, first and foremost, happy birthday. First and foremost, happy birthday, SMM. And second of all, what do you get? What, what are the cool thingies you got? I'm trying to check quickly to see what kind of bug troubles I could be having here. My main trouble... So, I have like two big problems with the current lag commands. Uh, so I have two problems with the current lag commands. The first one... Uh, the stacks are not stacking. And the second, lurks are not detecting the 
names. So these are the two problems I need to fix. For your birthday, I <laughs> teach you next time. No, it's 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 almost it's been almost six hours. I have I have to to head off soon, unfortunately. Most notable being huge monitor and stream day MK MK2 noise. Even though, like, I I am going to be to be do doing the old man thing and say that the stream deck is a bit of an overrated piece of tech. But that's because I have access to the iron board. Soon in the grand scheme of things, right? Like tomorrow, I have to, uh, to head off tomorrow? And actually, it's already tomorrow for me. So tomorrow will be would be, would be Tuesday to me. So Tuesday would be in, in about 22 hours? So yeah, no way I'm, I'm, I'm extending that long. <laughs> I could say a little bit more of uh, just for, just to chat though. All right. But yeah, uh, so, oh, quickly, quickly before I head off, though. Let's see. Quickly before I head off. Uh, ba 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 Fixing a couple of things here. Hmm, how would I do it? Because it would be hard to, to properly show the... Uh... So right here, I guess? Ah, this is too huge. Oh no! I've done a mistake. There we go. Uh, that would be that would be a little bit weird, actually. This needs to be to be a little bit higher. Like this one, this one here would be would be at the perfect the perfect spot. I think the stream deck is cool because it's smaller than most macro stuff, and the fact that there's a screen means you never have to put on pictures if you do that kind of thing with a stream deck. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. You can do that with Leo and Ball as well. Like you can put pictures and you can f do do colors and you can do all the things as well. This is Sparta! Just wanted to show this. <laughs> Ça, no, one the... in the squat. Alina! Visage souriant. <laughs> Thank you so much, Alina. Wait, what is this? Oh, that is weird. That is a weird thingy that's happening here. What? What is that? What is it all about? Uh, that's because this is also... Okay. Well, I'm fixing this. Perfect. That said, Leo and Bolt has a ton of cool functions too. Leo and Bolt has a like an insane amount of things you can do. I have I have yet to see 
stream the, the normal stream the normal Elgato stream deck do as much as Leon Ball can do. Like let me create a blank button and show you uh, like all of the different things you can you can do. So you can mo make like different uh, commands like a, a if something happens th uh, then this happens or this happens or um, let's see uh, ba -ba -ba -bum. if this happens and this happens then something else happens like it's the, the comments are are integrating with each other and there, there's a lot of things you can do within OBS itself so you can change the visibility of a source you can change uh, its position its volume you can even make uh, things rotate you can make thing, things go in a, in a certain curve so this is how this this one works this is Sparta! I'm I'm moving the position using the well I'm moving the rotation and the curve using Leon Bolt using this. So yeah, there is there is a ton of things you can do by doing this. You can change the scene transitions, you can switch scenes with um, a simple a simple touch of a button, you can change text, you can change the visibility and settings of filters. Um You can of course use the the the, the stream deck has a media change. But yeah. Mankey is live and playing Pokemon Emerald. I'm done with Emerald for the day. <laughs> I'm done with Emerald for the day. I need to head off like in about in about 15 minutes. So this is why I'm just I'm just talking and chilling around and showing how how great this em did just Leo and Bold is as a whole. If you want, if you want, I can just switch to just yeah dang. Finishing stream. There we go. Map. Wait, it didn't change to just chatting. What, what the heck? There we go. So yeah, Leon Bolt like has a ton of settings altogether that you can use. You can even you can technically make a a clip button out of Leon board by using the save buffer the save buffer thing. I have yet to use it because the save buffer function in OBS works a little bit jankily on my side, but I'll try to find a way to do so. Uh, but you can you can do some math inside Leon board and you can do uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, let's see. So you can change the way the um, the volume works on on games and whatnot. So if I made, for example, uh, volume on ba -ba -ba -bom. where is it? Uh, go XLR. So if I wanted my volume to go from hundred percent to zero percent. In about 10 seconds, I could do this with a, with a single button, and then do the opposite uh, just by doing the opposite, just by having a button doing the opposite. Like it's that simple to to just modify things, um, modify things, modify your stream and change it. Customize it to be a much, much, much better experience. You can mute a source with a single button, like in the, the, the normal stream deck. Like, everything that the Elgato stream deck can do, this thing can do it and more. Like, I, I kid you not, learning how to... Um, learning how to... How to use this this entire system here will make your streams so much better. The entire MWEEP? I've done it the entire MWEEP system? All done using using a Leon board. 
Like, this is... This is as simple as that. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, no. Yeah, that's, that's for the Mweep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight lines. And all of that does... This. Mweep. It's really as simple as that. But yeah, so... Yeah, the, the, the MK2 was not something I, I was interested in at all, uh, given the, uh, the different changes they made to it. There was there was a couple of functions that were all right, maybe maybe okay, but the uh, the rest is nah. But yeah, so most of the commands you see, like even just changing the colors around the around the um, the little floof here. If I just collect these, I could just turn these into black lights. Or I could just turn these into Mario lights. Or I could turn these into crowd control lights. Like different different buttons that you can you can do and also <laughs> so yeah many different things you can do uh many different things you can have fun with i really really highly recommend at least taking a look at it and playing with it yourself even if you're not going to be using it in the long run try to understand what it's all about Try to find a problem you have right now inside your stream and solve it using Leo Renbold. At least a single one. Trust me, it's worth the, it's worth the learning. And the best part about it is that there is a, uh, a good website, well, a good documentation about uh, what everything does. So, Leo Renbold. Like, the documentation for everything on the list is well explained. Like, everything is, is well explained as to what they do and what you can do with it. So it's a little bit, a little bit hard to read here, but yeah. Everything is, like, well explained and... And what you can expect out of the... Uh, of the command is plainly written. So yeah, really, 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 even, even if you have a stream deck already, I urge you to try it out. Yeah, at the very least, it's the same price as the, uh, the original stream deck, MK1. Which is overpriced. <clears throat> uh, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> but yeah, so... Everything that I've done using Leo and Bolt, I might want to, to try and find a way to, to make it so that everybody can use, for example, uh, the Mweep or the pet. I want to make to make it so that anybody could just throw a, a random PNG of a of a, of a simple pet and just be able to do to do this. Uh bah. <laughs> as simple as that. It is slightly the brand because like Elgato is just like a super super premium company. It's it's Logitech. Elgato is owned by Logitech. So 
So, yeah. Oh, wait, no, no, uh, never mind. Never, no, 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 no. It's not Logitech, it's Corsair. It's Corsair. Elgato is owned by Corsair. Either way, it's, it's, for, for what it does, it is way too much. So, are you only clear enough? This year, this year, this keyboard right there, the Corsair K55 is actually a better stream deck than the stream deck would ever hope to be. Every single one of these keys is changeable with the, the IQ system. And of course, you can integrate the other boards to work with that kind of keyboard. So it's, a, it's easily one of the better, the better options when you want to do a macro keyboard. And yeah, every single key being able to, 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 be, to be completely changeable, uh, even to keys that are not normally going to be used in any kind of keyboard, is a major boon, in my opinion. Is your own bone on phone or something? You can use it on Android. You can use it on Android. I do have Leroy and and enter it, so like you can see, um, I have my I have my my stream deck right there. Uh, if I go on into my phone, bah, 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 which is right around here, I guess. Ba ba bum, ba ba bum. So let's see. Uh, channel point commands. All right, uh, let's activate the the cancel mode from my phone. There we go. So yeah, as you can see, I can activate different effects from the phone itself as well. So yeah, there, there's literally no reason to take a stream deck in this day and age if you have Leo and Bolt. But let me let me let me let me say this straight away though. If you do have a stream deck already, that's even better because Leo and Bolt is also compatible with the stream deck. You can use Leo and Bolt commands with the stream deck if you do it properly. So this is this is still something you can do. But yeah. So it's a little bit of my old man rant about about Leo and Bolt and how and how great it is, how uh and how you can make powerful things with it. I kind of want to make like a, uh, a small like power course through through that program and what the different comments do, uh, like making it, making your own little channel point redemption from it, like with simple simple explanations and whatnot. But I don't know exactly how I could be doing this without without rambling and and making like a, an interesting teaching experience but it is definitely a tool that any streamer that wants to grow needs to have like if you're if you're not having that um if you're not having that program in your toolkit you're actually doing yourself a disservice But yeah, maybe maybe one day I'll make I'll make like a, a small crash course about how to use how to use Leon boards. I well, I wanted to do that in a video, and I had like an, an entire um, script about it, but I never managed to make it because it was like really really long and like it was an hour and a half, how an hour and a half of editing. You may have to learn some of it eventually if you ever wish to learn. Uh, about how to use the iron boards. Just hit me up and I'll I'll help you out. I'll definitely help you out. Like the the, the biggest the biggest way the biggest way you can help yourself with the iron boards 
is first. First, you analyze your stream. Then, uh, you isolate a problem. So, for example, uh, I can't I can't change the title easily. Or I uh, can't clip can't clip. And then free you um, you create you cr you you um you put onto paper how the uh, how the the process is going to be so you you analyze the process uh no, actually you think of a solution first And then you process it using the ironbolt. Managed to fill everything out on the affiliate and got it. Nice. And you're going. You might. You may take me up on that as well, Nadit. Absolutely no problem. I would love to share it to show more about more about the ironbolt and how to use it properly. Well, actually, properly. Is a big word because I'm still not using it properly, or else my my luck command would be actually working as well. But yeah, so you analyze your your own stream, you isolate a problem, you think of a solution, and then you use the bolt. By the way, if there's any problems in joining the Discord or getting a role into into this called please do tell me so that i can i can give you the right rights there has been a, a weird a weird janky thing about the the roles that i might need to fix but otherwise we should be good on that the main the main problem is when somebody subs before joining the discord and so the system doesn't detect that somebody has had like never read the rules so it gives them no role but even when they click that they have the they have read the rules it's not going to give them anything which is weird so yeah Yeah, this is this is something I, I love about Leo and Bolt because those those problems a lot of those problems are fixable. Very easily fixable using Leo and Bolt. Seems like perfect. Perfect. And also welcome to the Discord. <laughs> So yeah, that's that's roughly it for the day. Uh, that is roughly it for the day. Thank you all so 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 much for being the wonderful people you are. And also, uh, I tried to make something interesting. So something interesting for a video, and then ended up doing this. I'm kind of scared of what I'm of the powers I have of editing things. I'm kind of scared. And so you should be. <laughs> that was that was supposed to be a section I had on on my 64, and I ended up I ended up doing this. So let's see, what have I done? <laughs> the best part the best part is here. <laughs> The best part is right there. Um, <laughs> I 
Heck you know. <laughs> This is why I've said, I, I've said something to Morpha that was alongside the lines of This is why you don't give editing power to just anybody. That's too much power to give to someone. <laughs> That's way too much power to give to someone. Alright, um, does anybody have like a right target for me to just send your, send your love to? Otherwise, I might just call it off for the day and... And... For tomorrow. So, um, I'll be taking a tiny little bit of a break from... Um... Origami King. And I'll be doing some more Mario 64 RAM hacks. Because I've, I've, I've truly missed those uh, during the week. And I'm not anywhere near done Origami King. So, yeah. So, next next Monday, which is actually today uh, in, in France. Because it's, it's like 2 a.m. right now. Um, <laughs> so yeah, on the next on the next stream we'll be doing some Mario 64 and have. Is it going to say the target for something unsettling right now? I don't know what you mean. Unsettling, unsettling. Perfectly fine. Absolutely fine. Absolutely fine. <laughs> perfectly okay. This is this is perfectly okay, my books. Uh what can I send you all up to? I used to be an adventurer like you, and then I was enslaved by a pink princess. <laughs> I'll, you'll see. You'll see why I made this uh, when you see the video. I, I, I made this for a reason because I couldn't do a voice, a third voice. So I made an entirely different voice, and this ended up like this. You'll see. You'll see why exactly. You don't want to see it. <laughs> you will. <laughs> um. So, yeah, I don't. I, I can't find anybody here, unfortunately. So I'll, I guess I'm going to be to be just hanging off for the day. Because everybody is like doing some Minecraft, some World of Warcraft, some Sims, some uh, some Metroid Prime. Like I'm not. I mean, yeah. Nope. Or either that, or they might, they, they might be a little bit... They might have like a little bit of a mouth. If you get... If you catch my drift. So, yeah. So for now, I'll be leaving you all off here. Thank you all so much for being the wonderful people you are. And I will see you on... Well, uh, today, <laughs> because it's Monday, uh, today on Mars 64, I don't know which rum hack yet, so we'll see, we'll see kind of what kind of rum hack. I'm kind of interested in seeing what kind of, of fun we can have onto this. But yeah, thank you all so much, and I'll see you today, later on. Take care.